What's up, PD? Good morning. I lost small yesterday. I just bet a bunch of the under stuff. Oh, let me turn on the lights here. I just bet I bet under first half in game for every single game. And then I bet Kentucky second half like a fish, which of course that was my one random play that lost. Otherwise, I just bet all the unders. Today, basically same thing. I bet all the unders except uh, I also bet like a favorite parlay sort of a thing. It's, I'm just being fishy. College basketball, not really my thing. Yeah, that's why I bet the unders. What's up, Efro? How you doing? It is an early morning. Brown dog sighting.
How is the Efro doing? <clears throat> I was happy for Karim hitting that super the other day of Caitlyn. I know you were happy too. Nice. Just glad he finally hit something. Hitting a lot of Caitlyn. I'm surprised there's such a big market for Caitlyn. I think, isn't it Caitlin with a Y? I think it's, isn't it Caitlin with a Y? No? Caitlin. No, maybe not. You're right. It's Caitlin with an I. I thought it was Caitlin with a Y. I could have sworn I thought it was a Y. I must have miss, miss saw. We have like a lot of new products showing up today on this channel. We have, they'll be here in a couple hours, like a lot of random new products, a bunch of stuff. whole bunch of random stuff. We're getting the Kakawao, the Star Wars, we're getting some, uh, we're getting like a bunch of stuff. There's like, they're also coming out with like a Disney Marvel, is it, yeah, I think it's a Disney, it's a Disney Star Wars, Disney Star Wars collaboration. Yeah, what's up with that, bro? How do you feel about that? 
Would you have rather they just gave Vientos more of a shot? Was it one year, 12 million? Does JD still have anything left in the tank? Twelve million's a lot. Like, is he still good? I know he was really good. He was incredible. Oh my god, really? I have to look at the stats. I mean, he's a very professional hitter. How old is he? He's thirty-six, man. He's getting he's getting old. Did have a very good year last year. He did have a good year, man. He did have a good year. I don't expect him to have that good of a year next year. I expect him to have... Wow, he did that. He did all that in 113 games. I just realized that those numbers all came in 113 games. He had a very strong year. You're right. 33 home runs in 113 games, 103 RBI. He strikes out a lot, man. He was better than those numbers, but it's a little frustrating to see that once upon a time he walked 100, or he, once upon a time he walked 72 times and he struck out 138 times. Now he walks less than half that and he strikes out more. I once I don't know if you ever saw this Efro. I once I once watched a I once watched a video on how JD Martinez keeps his hands back. No, he has not been low strikeout this whole career. That's not true. He strikes out a lot, but he just used to walk a little more. He strikes out a lot. He I'm looking at his stats right now. Struck out 178 times in 2015. That's a lot. He's always struck out. He just used to walk more. I mean, I don't know. He struck out a fair amount. But whatever, at least it's consistent. You can look at his career numbers and you can see consistency. I don't mind that. I respect that. You kind of know what you're going to get. I watch, I used to watch a video of him. I, I, I was just about trying to tell you this before about how he keeps his... Uh, how he, how he keeps his hands like really far back like when he's like like when he's batting like most guys like you know they swing like he like keeps his hands like as far back as possible like that's his thing is like to keep his hands as far back as he can until the very last fraction of a second that's his whole thing like yeah no I know that's good I'm just saying that's literally like his thing like, if you were to ever watch a video on him, like, there's literally, he, he literally says, like, when he figured it out, it's all about keeping his hands back. He is, he is supposed to be very smart when it comes to hitting. That is true. That I, that's what I've heard as well. 
I do think that he'll be really good for the kids. I agree with that. That's why I didn't realize his numbers were that good last year when they signed him for $12 million. I figured they overpaid him, and they were just getting a veteran presence to teach the young guys some stuff. I thought they were just getting a veteran for that purpose. I didn't realize that his numbers were actually pretty good last year. They're very good. His average is going to be poopy, though. His a- he's going to have... He's probably going to bat like 250, 260 this year. He'll bat like he'll bat like 255 this year. But the slugging will be there. If his OPS is 850, I'm happy. He was also in a good lineup last year. I don't know. We'll see. You're all, yeah, when it comes to Vientos, it's like, I don't even mind. It's like, it's okay. No, Vientos will be good, but like, what's up, Ball Rush? Vientos will be okay. Which spot do you keep trying to get, Ball Rush? The negative spot? The negative refractor? Nice, Ball Rush. That's a good nickname. See, that's a good that's a good name for a fantasy baseball team that probably nobody's thought of. Viento Sausages. Hello, Jim. Yard work is actually can be therapeutic. <coughs> Yard work can be very therapeutic. <laughs> nice, counselor. That's a good one, though. The Viento sausages. I'm with you on the Montgomery. Is that a Maggio doing work in my number 17 over here? Is that a Maggio sighting? Looks like there's a second player break in the store, by the way, for... Uh, for baseball. <laughs> NBA is, you know, you know, Ball Raj, there's an expression, right? Some people like being a big fish in a small pond. And some people like being a small fish in a big pond. The counselor over here He's a big fish in a small pond. On the basketball channel, he's more of a small fish in a big pond. <laughs> uh, NASCAR got a big push just now. I'm a, I'm a nerd. I'm not even a closet nerd. I'm just an I'm an out. I'm just an actual nerd. <laughs> I'm I'm a nerd. Ah, everybody's a supermod on basketball. Do 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 do. That's see, that's that's the way Harrison's the sharp one, stocking the pond. That's the sharp move right there. That's the sharp move. Stocking the pond is where is the, that's what you want to be doing. Isn't that what everybody uses, Ball Rush?
Um, I have to look at it, Jim. I'll look at the recap real quick, and I'll answer that. Let's see. Oh, there was a Black Genie in there at the end. That was a good card. I'm watching the recap now. One second, Jim, I'll answer. Had a Purple Mini. That's a good card. Red and Black Aurora is a good card. Eh, that was like okay. A Black Genie is a pretty good card, but that wasn't like anything like, oh my god. I thought everybody used the one that you used, CGC. Um, that's what I thought. I think my, 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 my dad used CGC when we were grading our comic books. That's a pretty, like, that's like, a, having a black card is good, but, and one red and black, I don't know, I feel like that's a pretty standard break. What's up? Yeah. I was gonna, I forgot I was doing a double today. I was gonna, that's why I said I was gonna come by. I can just send somebody to pick it up if you don't mind. I'll tell my dad to come by it's not before he comes in. How are you? Good. I'm excited to get all these fun products. Yeah, no, it should be fun. You guys open any Dynasty over there on uh, at the at the uh, shop today? Mm. A little bit, maybe? We'll probably have a case or two open. Nice. Ooh! Yeah. Dude, they did your Giants dirty. And the checklist. I didn't even see the checklist. There's not even Buster there. It's just cuts. Well, I guess that saves me money. Yeah, there's <laughs> so, no buster this year. That sucks. I know. I'm really pissed off. They did the Giants dirty. The two teams they did dirty are the A's and the Giants. Really, the Giants. They have cuts, but that's it. It's crazy. Well, that uh, saves me a bunch of money this year. So I, I'm, I'm really surprised that they didn't. Yeah, that they didn't put buster in. No, unless you want the cuts. No. Yeah. No. What Happy is, Friday, everybody. What is it, Mel Watt? Um, there's a bunch, actually. I think there's a handful. I know a lot. George Kelly, probably. McCovey, Monty Irvin, Carl Hub uh, Hubble, and Bubba Thompson. Or Bobby Thompson, excuse me. Yeah, Bobby guess, Thompson, that's like cool. It, like it sucks because Bobby Thompson, Monty Irvin, and McCovey, yeah, all had on card autographs all these years. So, uh, like, what's a cut really worth? <laughs> Bobby guys. Thompson's cool though. Shot her in Red Row. That's cool. Yeah, I feel like Bobby Thompson and McCovey would be the two that I would want. But, but Mel, Mel Ott will be a decent one. Yeah, I mean, Carl Hubble is probably a seven hundred dollar card. And then they have a Dynasty Dual Relic Cut Signature. Dual relic yeah, McCovey. of McCovey. Yeah, which too, it's a bat piece, probably two bat yeah. pieces. That's cool. McCovey's cool. Mariners have some stuff. Bro, Mariners have a lot. They're low. They've all this Julio, all this That's WBC. Really Cardinals. Oh, wow. All the Griffey stuff is going to be nice. Wow, look how many freaking cuts the Cardinals have, bro. Yeah. That's a lot. Look at how, like, oh, poor. <laughs> the Rays literally don't have a card. The Rays don't have a card in Dynasty? What? Every team should have a card in Dynasty. I agree. Yeah. At least one. Every every team should be represented in Dynasty. Look at this, too. Also, the Pirates, they screwed the Pirates, too. Yeah, you got a Clemente cut, at least. Yeah, the Clemente cut is cool. And I like Kiner. I mean, all those are that... Those are all good, actually. Kiner and Stargell, Clemente, but still, it's just cuts. Hmm. 
Mm. Thank you, Lori Boulder. Yogi Berra, Roger Maris, Babe Ruth. You know, I'm not sure I ever told you this. My friend in college, he married Yogi Berra's granddaughter, like really good friend of mine in college. Well, like, they were like together like when we were friends. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. He, he became a boxing promoter. The guy, his the grandson became a boxing promoter. Maris Barrett, Thompson. Yeah, there's the Judge Wemby duel, dual auto. How many are, it doesn't say. Is there just one, or is there more than one? There's a, a out of five and a one of one. For these? Mm -hmm. Wow, man, there's a lot of that. Jeez. The Volpe, Rizzo. I mean, Yankees are always the biggest team by far. Frozen and Toy Story are the two biggest movies. And, and then there's Mickey and Minnie are also huge. Donald, Daisy, Uncle Scrooge. Thank you, bro. Yep. Too. Yeah, for sure. Let me know if I need to send somebody. Um, and I don't mind doing it. Okay. All right, thank you. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, any of the movies with the princesses are good. For a second, Balraj, I thought you asked me if if Daryl Strawberry was in Disney. <laughs> I swear, when I read your when I read your question just now, I read is Daryl Strawberry in Disney? <laughs> straw the Straw Man is not in Dis Dynasty this year, nor is he in Disney. Maybe he'll be in the Disney update. Probably Rapunzel, Bullwinkle. I'll go with Rapunzel. Fifty-four. So that was the first break. That last fifty-three was the first break. So we haven't hit the auto yet. Guys, let's do the NASCAR. Somebody take some cheap spots in the NASCAR. Wow, counselor. Shots fired. Shots fired. <laughs> People catching strays out here. Yeah, I forgot Crawford was in there last year, too, Counselor. That's true. I forgot about that. Soon it'll be Reggie Crawford and uh, the other guy. Efro, are you still there? I have, guys, I have like a very, very bad idea. <clears throat> I have a very, very bad idea. My wife has been visiting her family for a couple months. I have been a little bored. I've been getting my ass absolutely whooped in poker, so I've taken a little couple weeks break here. I lost like 160k in 10 days. I was like, you know what? Yes, months, Efro. She's doing some renovations on her family's house in uh, on their property there. She's they're building. She's building like another wing on the house. They have like it costs like eight dollars to build like a whole mansion there. So she's building a mansion in Honduras. Um, I'm not even kidding. It costs like nothing. I sent her like five grand. She's literally building an entire other section of her house. Um, she's not in construction now. But anyway, no, so since she's in Honduras for another, whatever, few weeks, I guess, I have grown a little bored. I have an extremely addictive personality. I'm thinking, I also am obsessed with video games to the point where, like, when I play them, I obsess over them, and I just don't stop, and I just master the game. I've never once taken an at-bat in MLB The Show, and I'm considering 
driving over to Best Buy tomorrow and just buying MLB The Show and an Xbox and just becoming an addict. I don't think it's a good idea. <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea, but I'm thinking about it. I'm considering it. I literally, about 9.30 last night, I had an urge. And if Best Buy was open at 9.30 last night, it would have actually just happened last night. Yeah, I don't know, Efra. I'm old school. And Best Buy is like eight seconds from my house. Cheaper than Poker Harrison. I'm a winning poker player annually for 20 years straight. I just happened to lose recently. I don't have any losing years. It's not cheaper than poker. It's way worse than poker. Poker, I actually make money. MLB The Show is a waste of my time, hypothetically. But Do not put chocolate syrup on my sushi, says Balraj. Okay, noted. Noted. I can clearly can I can clearly see the direct relevance to chocolate syrup on sushi and to MLB's the show and Best Buy. Makes perfect sense. Um, <laughs> what games do you play, Harry? Harry, what games do you play? Poker is the nuts. I do, I do kind of miss a, l a little bit of pokers. I'm just tired. I don't want to play online. I just want to go play live. I've been doing poker for 20 years, Jim. Fortnite? No way. I know too many, like, 17 to 19-year-old little wizards at Fortnite. I'm never playing Fortnite. I might, as well, I might as well go back to playing Duke Nukem and Wolfenstein 3D. <laughs> they won't let me, Efro. They don't let me buy into my own breaks. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. What game does... Harrison, what game do you play? Nice, Jim. It's probably a really good game, Dram. Did I upset Harrison? Did he leave? Um, <laughs> ball rush. I can do that. I can do that with crypto. I don't need you for that. Just send random people money and hope I get it back. Call of Duty? I've joined a couple of them, Efro. I just haven't, I just, I should turn notifications on, to be honest. Nice, Tram. I used to be good at those sort of games, like Counter-Strike. I used to play a lot of Counter-Strike. How old is Harrison? What exactly did I say that pissed Harrison off? I told him I was a winning poker player player for 20 years? There he is. <laughs> Call of Duty, self-proclaimed God. That's what you play? Harrison is 12, Harrison is 18. Okay, 30. Now, 30, it makes sense. If you're 30, that means you still have your, your like, like, quick reactions. And you can kick everybody's ass in video games. In about, like, eight years, that disappears, Harrison. Eight years? Six, six years? Eight years? When you're 36, 38, that eye-hand coordination of being a video game badass, it will disappear. It will, Harrison. Once upon a time, I was like you, buddy. Every video game I touched, I was a champion. I'm telling you. I get it. it, it in, in eight years, in, just enjoy it for six, eight years. You should be like Faker. Get them to make an ice cream, an ice cream candy. Get them to make an ice cream bar out of you. A Harrison T nine seventy eight ice cream Call of Duty bar. <laughs> that Faker, that Faker candy bar, whatever it is, man, that it sells pretty good. You're, are you in one Harrison? See, I knew. Do you have a candy bar? You need a, we need a Harrison candy bar. Oh my God. Oh my God, I just had the most amazing idea ever. 
We need Esplez ice cream. It's just going to be Esplez's face. We could do Jags, too. We could do Jags, too. We could do a Jags. and It's bald, though. There's no flavor on top. Esplez has hair. You can put the chocolate. What do you do for Jags? A little fuzz? You could do golden fuzz. That could be like, what, what flavor would the gold be? It would be a loud ice cream. It'd be like mouth open ice cream. <laughs> oh, yes, that's right. That's right. The little yellow fuzz on top, that's Mountain Dew flavoring. You're genius, super fam. It's Mountain Dew flavoring on top of the ice cream would be the fuzz. I mean, dark chocolate, just because that's my thing, counselor. Has to be dark chocolate. Fudge. <laughs> Whoa, Harrison. Do they, the, 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 the unclipped? Do they come with a fungus? I love dark chocolate. I, I do not really, I, white chocolate is absolutely disgusting. Milk chocolate is like mildly tolerable. And then dark chocolate is really where it's at. I love dark chocolate. Oh my God, I found this thing at Whole Foods. Holy crap, it's so good. Hello, Dad Tip. We have it. It's had the Marvel Platinum. It's here, Dad. I was told it's going to be added to the store today. Um, what the hell was I just talking about? Oh, they have this thing at Whole Foods? Holy crikey, it's so good, man. No, no, no. White chocolate's disgusting, Ball Rush. I'm sorry. We can agree to disagree. Dark chocolate and walnuts, we can agree on that one. They have this dark chocolate at Whole Foods. It looks like... It looks like, I don't even know, it looks like there's little, like, gold chunks inside, but it's not gold. I don't know what the hell it is, but it's freaking amazing. Whatever the hell it is. My cleaning ladies threw out the last batch I had of it. I'm kind of pissed off about that. I have to go buy more. Man, I, I forgot. I was, like, gonna... It's like, I was almost went to Whole Foods the other day, and I couldn't remember what it was that I wanted to get from there. That is what I want. Is that dark chocolate with that, whatever that gold stuff is in, inside. Yeah, white chocolate sucks. I'm sorry, Balraj. White chocolate sucks. When somebody tells me white chocolate, I think of Rita from Groundhog Day. How about that? When somebody tells me white chocolate, I think about Rita from Groundhog Day. I think she I think she hates white chocolate. He like it's like when he's when he's finally making progress with Rita in Groundhog Day, at one point he's like, "Oh, white chocolate." And she's like, "Oh, I hate white chocolate and fudge." And he's like, "No white chocolate, no fudge." And she's like, "What are you doing? You're making a list about me?" Ned? Ned Ryerson? Somebody told me, whatever, somebody told me this weird theory that in that movie, Ned is actually like symbolism for the devil or something like that. I don't know. I'm not religious man, but Watch out for the first step. It's a doozy. <laughs> I mean, I probably was counselor. Yeah, people that like white chocolate, I don't know. I don't know questionable nascar is really close can we close it out it's not like the most appealing filler just because 
there's no crazy expensive spots, but I mean, you think you could spike it, Fokker? Yeah, but I'd have to get pretty high. I bet you would, Panama Red. Somebody take one of these teams, one of these spots in NASCAR. Somebody tell me two or three spots in NASCAR and I'll give you a price. I'll give you guys a discount. I just want to open some packs. There's $180 worth of spots left. <laughs> that's like the best. I, Harrison, I think that's the actual best scene in any of the Meet the Parents movies. I have nipples, Craig. Could you milk me? I think that literally is the best actual scene. Groovy and Blue Reactive. I thought Blue Reactive sold in the store. Maybe I missed it. Hold on. Let me see if Blue Reactive is still there. I could have sworn I thought it was sold. Oh, no. It is still there. Wait, what? Carolina? Hold on. Oh, Groovy. Yeah, Groovy. All right, send 20 bucks. Let's go, Dad. I just want to see it. Who else wants spots? What's up, Stro? Who else wants a couple spots in the NASCAR so we can open some stuff while we hang out here? They're all cheap. Tell me two spots. I'll give you a discount. Pick your fighter for UFC instead of pick your parallel. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't make it. You think pick your fighter? Thank you, Dad. The NASCAR is actually really good. We have to, it's expensive, Phobia. How many, how many fighters are there, Phobia? Marvel, we're going to add Marvel today. I have to go on baseball at 4 p.m., but we're going to add Marvel today. Hopefully we can get to it today. But that might take a long time to fill, right, Phobia? I mean, not that this is filling any faster, but... I know, but it's not my job to add a ball, Raj. I just, I tell you what they tell me. No, it's, it, we're, a Dynasty release day is today, but we're not doing it until Sunday, Efro. Would I ever take, I'll just take them both out for you. Base non. Wait, what? And Black Non. You mean for UFC? The base, the base auto, you mean? The base non is already gone. I haven't looked, Phobia. It's, again, it's like, I don't mind doing that, but... It's not really my job. Like, I'm happy to do it. But they don't want me doing anything other than breaking, really. And and a lot of and these things kind of require time, you know? I'm happy to add things to the store. I just don't know the right way to do it. I would love to look into it, Phobia. It's Inception release day also, Efro. We'll do some of that at 4 p.m. when I get over there. I need coffee, too. Refractor Non is a good spot. Refractor Non is a good spot. 
The black not... We haven't hit any blacks at all. No black cards to 10 in the UFC yet. We did an entire case and we hit zero black cards. I saw somebody else open up a case and they hit like four. The refractor non-auto spot gets good volume though. Phobia, send me a link to somebody, send not here in the room, but send me a DM or a text Yeah, trust me. I know Efra. I agree. I don't know. I guess Backer really wants to. Uh, he wants to 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 drop the thunder on Sunday. Send me a DM with a link to somebody that's doing it the way that you think we should do it. I'll take a look, and then and then maybe I can request that somebody adds it. Who else wants a couple spots in the NASCAR? Tell me. Wow, the reactive orange is there. That's like the best spot. The reactive orange is literally the best spot. In my opinion, I love. It. I think it hits all the time. I woke up in a new Bugatti. The WWE Prism Hobby, also same thing. If anybody wants any of these spots, let me know. I'll hook you guys up. I want to open some packs. I mean, the color is not moving that well, Phobia, but I can definitely, it may be the fighter by the fighter will move. You just think all these random obscure fighters will sell? If there's so many fighters, it might take a really long time to fill it up like a player break. But maybe we could do like more than one case at a time. That's the thing. If we did multi-case, then maybe it would work. <laughs> I'll take a look. There's no TV in here. I can't even watch the college. I have under everything. I bet all the unders. I'll probably lose everything. No, I'm going to win that one. I woke up in a new Bugatti. I need Baylor to win for my ridiculous parlay. If anybody would like any of these teams or spots or colors or movies, please let me know. I'm here to help. Brown Dunk on the Pop Channel. We'll be on baseball a little in a little bit, but we're enjoying ourselves over here first. Wow, this place delivers Escargot? Go? No way. I think it might be a little early for escargot, but I am in later. <laughs> they have chicken noodle soup and stuff. Should I get like, they have breakfast sandwiches? They do. Ham and cheese croissant? Uh, nah. I like Yukon, but I think Baylor looks good. But I like Yukon to win it all. I know they're the favorite. Snail for breakfast is fire. Spoken like a true Hawaiian. They have a ham. Ch Why? Who wants mayo? I don't know. What are these people that want mayo? You think this normal? Mayo? Ham, cheese, and mayo? Turkey, cheese, and mayo? That makes sense, but on a crepe? Ham, cheese, and mayo? Should I get a ham and cheese or a turkey and cheese crepe? What 
what should I get? A breakfast crepe. They have a breakfast crepe? What the hell is that? <gasps> yes. Eggs, bacon, and cheese. I am in. I am in. Breakfast crepe. Yes. 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 Should I get it over medium or scrambled? Ooh, that's in a crepe? This place could be good. On Seriously, I need your guys' help. Do I get it over medium? Or do I get it scrambled in a crepe? I feel like normally I would get my eggs over medium, but I feel like for a crepe, scrambled might make more sense. Any opinions out there? Any chefs in the house? Not scrambled? All right, we'll get it over medium then. I usually get over easy, but it's going to be messy. It's going to deliver messy phobia, so we're just going to get over medium. What's your decision, Harrison? Right, Escar? I love, I love Escargo, but it's too early. It's 10 in the morning, Harrison. It's 10 in the morning for Escargo. I could get a small. They have a small and a large Escargo. Should I get the small Escargo at 10 in the morning? They're literally going to look at the order and they're going to be like, who the F orders Escargo at 10.05 in the morning? 10 a.m. snails, exactly. Spam and rice sounds disgusting. You and Hama, you Hawaiians, man, the spam. No, thank you. Yeah, I'm not getting snails. Don't worry, Harrison. I'm joking. I am going to get a breakfast crepe, though. Over medium. With bacon. They have they have ham and cheese quiche, also. Or quiche Lorraine. <sighs> That sounds good too. Should I get a bre okay now I'm now we're just we're getting buck wild over here. Quiche Lorraine or a breakfast crepe? I think breakfast crepe. We'll go with the breakfast crepe. They have breakfast sandwiches too. I could get a breakfast sandwich. Probably, I agree, Dram. But since I discovered they have actual breakfast sandwiches. <gasps> wow, soup type? What? It comes with a soup? What do you mean, soup type? Soup type? What the hell is going on here? It's a breakfast sandwich. What do you mean, soup type? I don't get to pick soup. It's a breakfast sandwich. I'm so confused right now. That sounds good. They have coffee. That's why I'm ordering from this place in the first place. Quiches do deliver well. That's true. Cafefe. Let's get that cafefe, baby. Yes. Yes. Um, Peppermill, the diner on the strip phobia. Peppermill? Yeah, Peppermill. The two best breakfast places, well, the three best breakfast places, in my opinion, on the strip are Peppermill. Earth Cafe is really good, but it's expensive. It's at the win. And then Bagel Mania is very good. Off the strip, Bagel Cafe is pretty good. Dad Tip probably knows about all these places, right, Dad? You know, you definitely know about Bagel Cafe. You probably know about Earth Cafe, too. You should know about Peppermill, but you might not. Yeah, there you go. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. I want like a side of avocado. Why can't I just have avocado? Just give me some avocado. 
Um, okay. They have, wow, this place has so much stuff. I'm impressed. I am impressed. I'm also really freaking hungry, can you guys tell? Eggworks is good. Eggworks is good. That was my first, the first place I discovered here in Vegas for good breakfast. They have the most disgusting sounding soup. Zucchini and cream cheese soup. That sounds horrible. Cream cheese soup? Ugh. They have these fancy salads. I don't think I can handle a salad right now. La 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 bum bum. La 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 bum bum. La la bum bum. I could get a side of fresh fruit. Should I do that? I think I'll do it. Let's wear it. I'll wear it. Side of fresh fruit. It's early in the morning. They probably just freshly cut it, you know? All right, we'll give it a shot. We'll give them a whirl. Well, if we don't break anything, then I'm going to go over there soon, folks. La, 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 bum, bum. I can't put any notes in here, man. I want to put notes. You guys don't let me put notes. Max Payne. I'll give him a good tip. I'm a generous man. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. Go back. Go back. Okay, now... You got it. Fa -la 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 -la. I gave him a six dollar tip for a thirty dollar order. That's a good tip, right, Harry? What are we doing? What's happening? Nice. Players are flying in the dynasty break. That'll go on Sunday. No soup for you. <laughs> Let's check. I'll be right back.
I might just switch over to the baseball channel if we don't do a break here soon. Hiya. Who's a visual learner? I'm a visual learner too, Harrison. Harrison, do you play any instruments? That's a weird question, but it's an honest question. All right, some Disney's off. What's up, Beatles? Good morning. Good morning. All right, so we can do, let's do a break. Mini, Wreck-It Ralph. Zilla bought Volpe in the player break. That's a good buy. I was asking if you play any instruments, Harrison. Are you, is the Harrison a musician? Or is he a, a one-trick Call of Duty pony? <laughs> Musically inept. All right. We can't be perfect at everything, I guess. Do you have a lovely lady, Harrison? Oh my god, I ordered from way far away. Oh my god, what did I do? God damn. I ordered, I ordered food from the wrong location, mad far away. Whoops. Wow, that's funny, Efro. Now, you, do you follow Chris Egg on Twitter? Chris is going to be so pissed. Chris wants to see Vientos get the playing time so bad. Now, now Vientos hits a home run. <laughs> I, love, I love opposite field power. I'm a sucker for opposite field power. I'm not talking about, like, the fluky down the line just around the pole opposite field power home runs. I'm talking about real opposite field power. I know you know what I'm talking about. Zilla, I really like your Volpe purchase. I saw you, I saw you bought Volpe in the player break. I really like that. Volpe has a good checklist in Dynasty this year. That's a good buy. And I think he was cheap, too, for the price. I think that was a really good buy. I hope you hit a lot of Volpe in that break. There is no Dynasty on here. Man, I feel terrible that I ordered from the wrong location for this food, man. This guy is driving, like, all the way across Vegas. I feel like such a dick. Total accident, but David in a Volkswagen is going to get a good tip. Wow, I feel like such a dick. Like, I literally could have ordered from the same place much closer. Ugh. Vaughn Grisham is a good buy, too. You know who, you know who really is having a ridiculous summer? Or a ridiculous spring, I mean? I mean, we talked about this before, is Chase DeWater. He is beating the living crap out of the ball. Chase DeWater for the Guardians is legitimately a bona fide stud. I think he's going to be really, really good, man. Nice, Michio. Get him, baby. I know he's a, he's a dumbass. I told him to raise it, Michio. I'm the reason that he raised it. He's such a, a donkey. Trust me, I know. And then after he raised it, he didn't even raise it enough. I helped him.
If Kyle Stowers is good at the game of baseball, then the Blaise Familia is going to be a wealthy group because we hit the best Stowers that existed, that's for sure. We hit all the best Stowers stuff. Truthfully, the guy we hit the most of, we really hit a lot of Ivan Melendez. We hit a lot of Jacob Berry. That's what I'm saying, Zilla. We hit some we hit some big stowers. Very big. The mullet man. Somebody take a couple spots in NASCAR. Dad tip did his piece. Somebody else take a take a, a spot or two. Purple Velo, red and blue hyper, reactive orange. And blue are good spots. The other ones are okay. If Leo Piguero becomes Mookie Betts, I'm buying a Lamborghini. <laughs> I feel so freaking badly that I have this guy David driving 20 minutes in a Volkswagen across Vegas. I feel terrible. I got to give him a bigger tip. I mean, you can probably do it on Instagram. I don't know, Michio. Instagram might have Dynasty tonight. I have no idea. Probably not. I would think maybe Backer will probably tell them no, but maybe Instagram will have it. Maybe not. Probably not, yeah. He'll probably make them wait. That's true. What's up, Tobin? Is that your Polly Shore? You coming in with the Polly Shore entrance? Buddy. I don't know, Stro, but once Backer is back, I think that things will start moving a little more normal speed again. He's been a little MIA since he's been out of town. I think once he's home, things will be back to normal. Um, we do have Inception, which is which just comes out today as well. <laughs> I meet you. The Inception is actually moving well. I'll add another I'll add another case of Inception for you guys now. Of the PYT. It's moving well. I put another case of Inception in there for you guys. I'll take a look, Stro. I haven't looked yet, no. Show me a, 10, a red 10. That's what I want to see. Oh, that's what it is. Let's go. Wow. We got a 10, dude. That's, a, that's huge. That's so huge. What is this? Oh, nice. I got it, Phobia. Stro, that's amazing. Who is the who is a uh 
Who is NYY? We know him. Who is NYY Collector? Who is that? Sasento, got it. Nice. I was going to say, I definitely know the name. Bro, that's fantastic, man. That's huge. I'm glad you're retiring, by the way. That's a gorgeous card, Stro. That's really a gorgeous card. I told you it could get a 10, bro. I remember telling you it was a 10. Is it pop one? Is it a pop one? Nice. Yeah, I figured it'd be a pop one. That's amazing. I remember pulling it. I remember I remember I remember it got a, it like looked like a 10 when I pulled it. Blue and red, red and blue non in WWE. The answer is probably. Red and blue non? Both, you mean the both nons? Yeah, of course, Bullwinkle. Absolutely, bro. I want to see that go. 100%, all you. Hello? I will be right there. Sorry, one second. Thank you so much. All right, let me go grab the. I me grab this too. Hold on. Wow, the guy was really nice. I'm glad I gave him a good tip. He totally deserved it. Gold auto and WWE for the Zilla. Oh my God. We're going to do a break. It's happening. It's happening. Oh my God, it's happening. Did you take it in the store, Zilla? You did, okay. Kroger. Oh my god, you're the worst. Harrison, that's Harrison's got jokes, man. Harrison's got jokes. Thank you, Bullwinkle. Harrison's got jokes, man. I like it. You guys are a feisty group, you basketball peeps. You guys don't play. You're a feisty group. Alright, there's my fresh fruit. Wow, this this guy did a great job. Considering this place was so far away, this is like still hot. 
Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, who are the four? I'm trying to think who the four are. Winkle and Balraj are definitely two. The counselor? Nah, is he one is he one of them? Is the counselor one of them? I'm trying to think of who the fourth is. There's no way Barry Maxson is one of the four dorksmen, is there? I'm trying to think of who the other ones are. Ooh. Burn. Wow. Honestly, I should be paying money for this show. I knew you would like that. I knew you would like that music. When I wrote the title, I literally, I literally thought to myself, music will appreciate this title. It's a good quote, by the way. WWE is only five spots away. Yep, Disney is definitely inching its way there as well. Beatles took a few spots. Star Wars, Star Wars is going to be here in like 45 minutes. 45 minutes. We'll have to add it to the store, though. Oh, C T I forgot about CTP. I forgot about CTP. AKZ is a hitter. I hit some good card for AKZ the other day, whatever it was. I forget what it was. It's a compliment, J&D. He's giving you compliments. Mm-hmm. AZL's a hitter. All right. And that's enough. I want to open some packs. That sandwich was good, though. That delivery guy got a good tip, and he freaking earned it. He came a far away. My food is hot. I am happy. But I do need to wash my hands. Hold on. Hey, 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 I'm Fat Al. 
Oh, Axel. Like Axel Foley? Like Beverly Hills Cop? Do, 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 do. Is the Truffle Shuffle from Goonies or is it from Beverly Hills Cop? Beverly Hills Cop. Do the Shuffle. From Goonies? There's a scene where they ask him to do the... Oh, the Oki Shuffle. It's the Oki Shuffle. O-K-I. That's... Beverly Hills Cop is do the Oki Shuffle. Remember the Oki Shuffle? When he's wearing the suit? The Oki Shuffle. Part three, Twelfth Man, wow. Twelfth Man knows his Beverly Hills cop. You know, this would have helped if they gave me a fork. A fork would have been convenient to eat some fruit with. Bro, what do you think I'm doing, Harrison? I'm taking a fruit to the face. That's literally what I'm doing. I'm eating it exactly like you're describing it, like a piggy in a truffle. Ooh, raspberries. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. I've smoked a blunt with James Wood before. I've told you guys that. Yeah. At the Borgata in Atlantic City, he was in the elevator. We were going upstairs in the when they, right after they built the water club, and uh, yeah, he was like, "That smells good." Where he's like, "Can I join you?" We're like, "Sure, why not?" <laughs> he came with us to our suite. In real life, he's literally like his character in, in Casino. He's like Lester he's like Lester Diamond in real life. He's kind of a dick, but whatever. I didn't get the snail soup, Harry. Nah, not like sleazy, just like he's not like sleazy. Just like um like, kind of like all over the place. Like, it's hard to describe. Maybe. I didn't say he wasn't smart, JMD. He's a little, he's got some unique takes. Let's just leave it at that.
he was like he was like kind of like a little bit of a conspiracy theorist. I don't know, a little bit. That was the vibe he gave off. He was just all over the place. He was also like quick, like like scatterbrained, but like, but not in like a dumb way. Um, he definitely likes to smoke some weed. Let's just put it that way. Okay. Yeah, maybe Harrison, maybe. From back in, he just, I feel like, but you know what? I feel like probably not. I feel like he's just like backer in the sense of like everybody thinks they're always doing drugs, but they're not. I mean, James, James at least smokes, smokes weed, but Jared doesn't even do that. Snow White and the Seven Dwarves, all seven of them, even though only Dopey's in the product, is off the J&D. Out of character? Maybe he was maybe he was staying in character from a for a movie, a movie role. One, two, three, four, five. Why do I have five when there's only four? There's three. There's seventeen. That is not on my screen, that's why. One, two, three, four, five. There's five spots left in WWE Panini Prism. Can we try a filler? The gold non-auto is still in there. One, two, three, four, five. If any, if anybody wants any of these spots in the WWE, let me know. I'll hook you guys up. I want to do a break. NASCAR or WWE? I say one for the money. Two for the show. Go, go, go. Blue suede shoes. The first half was bad. This this should this half should be good. I don't is I don't think this is wait, hold on. Is this this is this a fresh? I thought this was the second half. I think this is the second half. Yeah. Oh no, three boxer? Oh, the first, oh, oh, hold on a second, hold on. Yeah, we've done the first half of this case. It's been okay. There was like one. I feel like we hit like one good card in the previous few breaks that we did and that's it I don't remember what it was though I'm trying to remember what it was I can't remember what it was a good spot I don't know which one blue or red auto I, either blue or red auto I think we hit one I think we hit blue auto maybe red auto take red auto I think Blue Auto we hit already. I, I think... Yeah, I think we hit Blue Auto. I think we hit a Sergeant Slaughter Blue Auto. So I think you should take the Red Auto instead of the Blue. I think. WWE is really good. It's kind of high quality. It's surprisingly high quality. It's actually amazing how much comes out of a box of prism. I'm impressed. As a, a baseball guy, 
All right, you got it. Send send us uh, sixty bucks, J and D. I just want this to go. I really want to see it. Three spots left, and I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you guys a really good filler. Oh, James doesn't want to see it. All right, I'm killing it from the store. All right, send 30 bucks, James. Send 30. No, it didn't, Harry, but now you can have it. It didn't come in. It, the, you, the YouTube blocked the word kill. You got it. You, you, what, you know what you should do? You should say do skill. Or like, do like Kaylil. I know, I'm sorry. But I, on the flip side, I'm going to hook you up, Harry. I'm going to give you a really good deal. Ready? Watch this. Ready, Harrison? Watch this. How much do you want to pay for these two spots? Let's treat this like a price line for a second. How much do you want to pay? They're in the store for 138. How much does Harrison want to pay? Send 100 bucks, Harrison. Let's go. I just want to see it. I'm going to I'm going to go we're going to get other new product into it today. We have we have six boxes left in this case. <laughs> I'm not creative, Bullwinkle. I haven't smoked enough yet today. Harrison is a bright man. Harry, what are you going for a PhD in? I'm going to guess computer science. You probably... You're probably going for it in computer science. If if you're not going for it, then you should be going for it in computer science. Harry's too busy, like, hacking, like, the national treasury or something. <laughs> 2022 Panini. W. W. E. Prism. Hobby. Two boxes. Enough's enough. Tonight's the night. PYC number 15. It's like that, yeah, maybe maybe like that scene in the beginning of something like Mary Bowinkle. Oh. That's that hurt. One, two, three. The first time that I ever saw something about Mary when it came out in the theaters, that scene in the beginning of the movie where he gets it caught in the zipper is such a painful experience. When Every guy, when they see that, they just like, oh, they just cringe and grab their crotch area because just it hurts. It's just like when you see a guy get hit in the nuts. It just doesn't, it's just max pain. All right, you know what, guys, let's do it. To the left, to the left. Is 
there another one of these in the store? Right, let's put another one in the store. Twenty twenty two Panini WWE Prism Hobby. Let's go one box at a time. Let's just like you know what? Like we're not in a rush. We're gonna let's 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 milk it. Let's enjoy it. Let's be like backer, right? Let's be like backer. Ready? Watch this, guys. We'll go pack by pack. This is, I never go pack by pack. Well, let's go pack by pack. Well, let's enjoy ourselves here. Good luck, everybody. Do, 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 do. Welcome, this is a moment. Here we go. Bless you. Hyper of Kaylee Ray. There's Reggie on the red wave. And a fearless of Bianca. What's up, C-Dub? Eh, when you're not in a rush, you know. I'm literally taking my shoes off right now. I have a wooden foot massage thing that costs like $5 under the table. Maybe you can hear it. It feels good. Oh, yes. Let's go. All right. Here we go. <laughs> my little wooden foot massage thing. Stacy Keebler, who reminds me of that girl from Full House. A silver of Saray? 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 I don't know how to pronounce it. Oh! God damn it with these points. I hate these points things. Well, somebody probably jacked them. Congratulations. I'll do a random at the end. Probably won't matter. That's the one thing I'm not used to is the Panini points. Why do they have them facing that direction? Like, why don't they face it the other direction? Doesn't seem very optimal. All right, we got some color here. Orange and a cracked ice. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Commander Aziz on the cracked ice. And then Kenny Williams, the rookie, on the orange. Is the orange numbered? I think it is. Yeah, it is. Oh, that's the 99. That's not too shabby. Kenny Williams, orange. Orange rookie. I like the photography in this stuff. It's by far my favorite thing about it. Since we're not in a rush, you guys, it's, everything's getting extra take, extra special care. You guys, you know, you know, you know. Silver, cracked ice, red wave, hyper, yada 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 yada. Yada 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 yada. Alright, we got blue here. Blue coming up. Persia. The upside downer is a silver of true gulak. With the action shot and then a blue that's a good one gable stevenson on the rookie gable stevenson on the rookie blue to 199 
Somebody told me this guy has an Olympic gold medal. Gable Stevenson to 199 on the blue non for Bullwinkle. Winkle. Yeah, man. That's what it's all about. Hitting good cards and enjoying it. Enjoying the experience. All right, they're a little sticky, these base cards. Humberto. Jack Straz. We got Duke Hudson, Rookie Hyper. Valentina Faraz. I don't know how to pronounce Faroz or Faraz. Wow, she is jumping through the air. What a great picture. I love the pictures in this stuff. That's what does it for me. I don't really know anything. I, I know very little about this stuff, but I do know good photography when I see it. I like the pictures a lot. WWE is pure entertainment. Pure entertainment. Uh, you know what's funny is the only word that I caught in that entire sentence was the only word you spelled incorrectly because I'm still hungry. You said butter. I thought about butter and bread, and then you changed it to better. Now I have to read the whole sentence again. Yes. Okay, yes. I'm glad you got it, Harry. That's fine. Fire! If you got them, I'll throw them away. Silver of Reggie, a red of Tiamin. Tiamin, and that's not a, there's nothing wrong with the card. That's the rope. Rookie red for, for Winkle. I thought it was a print one at first, but it's not. It's got the New York area code on the card, Winkle. You'll never forget me. 212, baby. 212 out of 299 for the Winkle. And then Roman Reigns on the insert. Yeah, I mean, I'm not, I'm not worried about it, Harry. It's, they're just points. It's okay. It was an accident. It was my fault. Yeah, yeah. I've been, you know. What did actually happen to her? I was looking at that also. What actually? What's the truth? Edge on the hyper. Lash Legend, rookie on the Red Wave. I feel like we're doing pretty good with these rookies on the regular stuff. Red Wave. Who's got the Red Wave? Oh, Ruby Wave. Is that what this is called? Ruby Wave? James, Ruby Wave. Right? I didn't realize it was called Ruby. Why don't they just call this Red Wave? Is this really like a different color than this? This is red, but this is Ruby? Really? It's like that guy at the paint store, and he's like, no, no, no. It's a completely different color. <laughs> Whoa. No way, really, Ephro? That's horrible. That's sad. I didn't know that. Is she going to be okay? That's so sad. All right, we got an auto here. Here, I'm going to take the card off the back first. It's Alexa Bliss on the insert. The prismatic entrances. And then we have an auto. Tiffany Stratton there, rookie base. I know she's the chase in this product. And I was told her one of one is still live. Almost, almost on the silver. And then Walter. Walter refractor autograph prism autograph excuse me silver autograph silver auto third time's a charm sorry I'm used to baseball products third time's a charm Walter on the silver auto for Gates Walter silver auto That's pretty sad. That news broke the other day, Ephro, right? Because I was looking on the, I was reading the news and I felt like it hadn't broke yet when I was when I was reading it. 
four packs left in the first box. Two autos in each box, so we sh we still should have another auto here. Ooh. I can't tell if that's orange or gold. I really just, I'm a, I'm a blind old man. I'm sorry. I can't tell if it's orange or gold back there. Randy Orton on the fearless base. Here, now let's flip it upside down. Kushida on the cracked ice. And Batista. Batista on the orange. It's so close, I can't tell sometimes. Looked like it could, I'm staring at the card. I still am asking myself if it's gold or orange. To 99 on the Batista. It's hard to tell, right? I wasn't sure if it was orange or gold. Don't worry, we're gonna find a gold. We're gonna find a gold, that's okay. Orange for Gates, nice hit. 12 minutes ago, okay. Yeah, that's pretty damn recent, Ephra. I was, I was here. All right. I like doing this card in the back first because it's just a waste anyway. It's just the regular insert. The two hits are really right before that. A silver of Nash and then Alita on the great picture, on the blue. For, for the Winkle, I I really like the pictures on this stuff. Somebody told me the Stratton one hundred and one gold vinyl auto or whatever it's all still out there, right? Or the black is it black or one of one? The Stratton, the Tiffany Stratton one hundred and one. I think it's still live. That's what I was told. That's why Esplas told me he's like you should open the twenty twenty two. He's like the Stratton is still out there. Fabian, I don't know how to pronounce his last name, Alkiner, 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 and then Cedric Ander, uh, Alexander, excuse me, on the Ruby Wave. It's not red, it's Ruby Wave. Ha <laughs> ha, got him. One more pack in the first box. Do those points, do those points take place of an auto? Or is there an auto in this box, in this pack? I feel like there's going to be an auto in this pack. I don't really know how Prism works, but those points don't replace an auto, do they? Eichner. Okay, thank you. Eichner, thank you. Eh, maybe not. Maybe those points do replace the auto. Wow. Really? Silver of Akira... Tazawa. And then Mysterio with the most ridiculous picture I've seen yet. He looks like a Legionnaire in 300. That is awesome. <laughs> Mysterio for the Winkle on the red. It's 299. Look at that picture, bro. That's a great picture. <laughs> I love the pictures in this. Even this Akira Silver. Like, I would say a solid, like, 15% of the pictures of these guys flying through the air. My favorite part of these cards is, like, the outline. You can see, like, the outline on the silver. I just love that. They look like superheroes on some of the cards. That's kind of, that's kind of annoying that they replace an auto. I can't believe that those points are allowed. How is that allowed? Points to replace an auto? I'd be so pissed. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not trying to be negative. I would be pissed, though. I am pissed. Hold on. We're going to do the second box right now. Let me just put these base away. Take a sip of my coffee. We're enjoying the, the break.
Do, 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 do. Wow, this Northwestern FAU game is really close, huh? All right, here we go. Box number two, let's get it. Ooh, all right, here's an auto. An auto in the first box, first pack, excuse me. Sasha Banks up top on the base insert. An auto in the first pack. There's Trish Stratus. A silver of Joe Coffey. W-L-E. S-S-W-L-E. Who is that? Wesley. Ha <laughs> ha, Wesley. It sure is. The sensational base auto signature of Wesley. Wesley. I feel like this is a good product for Backer to break. Because he can't mess up this pronunciation, right? Even Backer would have pronounced this name right. Wesley. It's Wesley. A Wesley base auto. For JND? No. For Chris Reed, excuse me. Why are you getting excited, J and D? You're getting me getting me confused over here. I thought you got excited like you, you hit it. Chris Reed with the base auto. I agree. It's you confused me, J and D. I I agree though, it's it's more fun when he pronounces it wrong. Efro. It's true. Blair on the rookie, it's true. I learned that I I learned that over time. Cracked ice of a kid, the rookie, with a great picture. Excuse me, that's a great picture. Come on, man. What is he doing? A suplex there? Is that a suplex? And then upside down, it's Austin Theory, who looks like a character straight out of the Marvel universe. I feel like he just this is like his he just defeated Thanos. Look at that. Look at the background with the stars and everything. It looks like he just defeated Thanos. Ha ha ha, Backer is the best. I love that kid. Uh, that was an orange, yes. The Austin Theory was an orange, Winkle. Sorry. I apologize for not announcing that. Yes, orange, orange, Austin Theory. Silver of Montez Ford. And then Zili, Zili on the blue for the Winkle. Austin Theory is popular, Winkle. out of here for you. Zia Lee. 39 of 199. You got three blues and two reds over there so far. Three oranges. Three cracked ice. A bunch of silvers. A bunch of... Are they called hypers? Yeah, hypers. No, they do not, JND. They definitely do not. Not at all. I've hit zero. John Cena. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Joe Gacy, rookie. There's the A kid doing the suplex again on the hyper. And we got Eric, who looks like he's dressed like a Viking. Eric looks like a Viking. He either looks like a Viking or he looks like somebody in that, in that, like one of the bad guys 
in that movie with uh, with Diesel, where he they're like on another planet or something. Ritter, Riddick, Riddick. What is it called? Riddick, Reddick, Riddick. You guys know what I'm talking about. Holiday back in the minors, really. Of course I care about that. All right, we got a purple piece here. There's a purple piece here. Of course I care about that. Silver of wild boar and then a purple. Oh, that's a nice one. Seth freaking Rollins on the purple. And that's also a great picture. Well, that's good. I bet on Churio. Yeah, Chronicles of Riddick. That's the movie. Nice. 62 of 149 on Seth freaking Rollins. I bet on Churio to win Rookie of the Year this year, Efro. I bet small, not a lot. I know. I want to hit a card for Harry. We're going to get there. It's happening. It's going to happen. This box is going to deliver. Watch. This box will be a magical box before we're, before we're done with it. Valentina, Sam Stoker on the rookies. Primate, rookie. Kevin Owens on the hyper. And then a red wave of Carmelo Hayes. The pace of the game, or who are you rooting for? Wow, Langford's cards are going to keep going up, huh, Efro? Sick, man. What a spring he had. DeLauter's got to be in the majors too, right? There's no way they're not, they're not going to play DeLauter. All right, here's our auto. We got our other auto here in the back of this pack. Good luck. Good luck. There's the rock. Can you smell what the rock is cooking? Silver of Amelia McKenzie, rookie. And then our autograph is going to be upside down. Okay, no problem. C-M-H. It's Carmelo Hayes on the sensational SIG. Carmelo Hayes for Chris. Sensational signature of the rookie Carmelo Hayes. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, they're not very good. I feel like they were good like years ago, Harry. Let's find a Goldar Mojo to cheer you up. Come on. Give us a freaking gold. Give me the, show me the gold. Uh, this is going to be blue back here. Bailey on the fearless insert. JC Jane, Roman Reigns, Becky Lynch. Cracked ice of Roderick Strong. And then, ooh, that's a good one. A blue rookie of Braun Breaker for the Winkle. That's a good one. Even I know that's a good one. Winkle. 36 to 199 of Braun Breaker. Great picture, too. Hell yeah. I love, I told you I love what, how the outline of the card. That's it, that's it, you know, I love the ropes there, the way it just, it looks like this. I love the, how they do that. It's nice. I don't open, I haven't opened that much Prism because I spent so much time on the, uh, no, don't tell me that, Goat. I have the freaking under in that game. Are you kidding me, bro? God damn it. I have under like 143. I wonder if I can still hold. I 
I was counting that one as a win. No, I'm, I'm dead there. 143, 116. I'm probably dead. Damn. All right, well, the good news is we have a mojo. The good news is we have a mojo. Mojo time. A kid on. Oh, we have a bonus. There's a bonus hit in this pack. A kid silver rookie. A kid silver rookie. Solo. I don't know how to pronounce it. Sikwa? Sikoa or Sikwa? Sikoa? Solo red rookie for the Winkle. How do I pronounce it? Sikwa or Sikoa? O H O A or. Mojo. Mojo. Of Drew McIntyre as he's about to body slam this poor guy. Sokoa, thank you. Drew McIntyre is your mojo, Harry. Four out of 25. He's about to just drop that dude hard. Hard. He's going down. He's going down. What's up, Dark? Let me mod you up over here. You're good. You'll see me there today. I'll be over on baseball in a few hours. Welcome to the Pop Channel. You know, the Pop Room has a foot massage over here. Baseball Room doesn't have no foot massage. Yes, Inception release, baby. Bianca Belair. Is it Ginny on the rookie? Braun Breaker rookie. Apollo Crews on the hyper. And Cameron Grimes. The hair is going wild as he flies through the air. Look at all that. Look at all that hair. <laughs> He's got all the, a lot of chest hair, a lot of hair hair, a lot of facial hair. There's just hair. Cameron Grimes, the hairy monster. What's up, McEwen? What's up, mate? <laughs> I just modded you up. Welcome. Yeah, bro. This is the place to be. The pop channel is actually super hot. We have a blast here. We do a bunch of random stuff here that's really fun. Disney is the greatest product of all time. For, okay, so I'll give you guys the mini speech. I won't make it long like I usually do. But if, you, if you're here and you're hanging out with me on the pop channel, buy the cheapest movie that you see. For Disney. There's a silver of Carmella. And Rikishi also. But a red for the Winkle. Um, buy the cheapest Disney movie that you can find in the store. Buy the cheapest one. If you don't own any Disney cards, just buy any movie. The cheapest one. Get a few Disney cards sent to you. I don't care if they're base cards. And come back to me after you receive them and tell me that they're not the most amazing, nicest cards you've ever seen in your life by a lot. Because they literally put every other card to shame. I'm not even kidding. They make, they make basketball, football, and baseball cards look like amateur hour. The Disney cards are a special, a special breed. All right, good luck on the last pack here. John Cena on the insert up top. Da, 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 da. Hulk Hogan base, Seth freaking Rollins base, MVP. Indy Hartwell on the hyper and we're gonna end with a banger. Tiffany Stratton on the red wave, ruby wave for James. Banger for James.
banger for James here at the end. Tiffany Stratton, rookie. I'm going to shift it, Sherlock. I just haven't had time to do it. I am going to shift it. I have to get permission from the other guy that's in that the break with you. I want to see it go, Sherlock, so I'm going to shift it. Hopefully that helps it move. What's up, Noah? Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Recap coming right now. Wow, Northwestern is running away with this bad boy, huh? 127? I'm probably dead, but... All right, let's look at the Rizzy recap. Darb, I'm telling you, everybody in this room should buy the cheapest movie they can find in our Disney and... When you see the Disney in your hands, you'll be you're gonna hold it and you're gonna be like, holy crap, I didn't know it was possible they could make cards this nice. You'll see. Their base cards are nicer than the the parallels in other sports. Braun Breaker on the base, and then a bunch of silvers here. Let's look at the red waves. We have Tiff Stratton, that's a nice one. Last card of the break. Very, very, very nice card. Hayes on the rookie, Lash Legend rookie, Valentina. Some good red waves there for James. James did quite nicely. The Hypers. A-Kid. Duke. The Cracked Ice. A-Kid again. The reds, the blues, the oranges. Oh, I didn't show this. Sorry, a base of Tiff Stratton. Reds, blues, oranges, and purple pieces. Singular. Reds. The blues. There's Braun Breaker, which is a nice one. Lita and Gable. An orange of Austin Theory. Batista. Kenny Williams, orange spot did very well. And then Seth freaking Rollins, our lone purple piece. We had one mojo, Drew McIntyre, four out of 25. Very low numbered stuff there. And then we had three autos and some points, which were hijacked. Uh, Carmelo Hayes, Wesley, and then Walter on the prism silver, excuse me silver autograph that was two boxes of 2022's panini wwe prism hobby pick your color number 15 i thank all you guys for joining i appreciate you we hit some pretty good parallels there with the brown breaker the tip stratton thank you everybody that was the break I would really like to hold on this under here, on this game, this overtime under. Colgate Baylor is a loser, 150 whatever, wow. That's way over. This one, that's close. This one's way under, all right, cool. All right, let's take a look at other stuff. And then I can I can go. There's more stuff that should be here soon from Legacy. I can have somebody go pick it up. She's a brick house. What's next, McEwen? Um. What did you do, Harry? What did you do, Harry? 
Hello, human. Elemental is off. All right, let me update the Disney. We should do a Disney. I gotta. I can put something else in place of that prism. The NASCAR is really, really close. If somebody wants a generous kill, let me know. I'm going to update the Disney right now. If you're just joining this room, the Disney is elite. It's an elite, elite product. There's nothing quite like it. Blue, gold, and orange in the non-UFC. Gotcha, human. Let me see. <laughs> you guys are funny. One, two, hold on. One, 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 two. Rapunzel is off to our scales. What's up, our scales? And then one, two, one. Okay. Blue, gold, and orange, none. Orange, none. Gold, none. Blue, blue refractor. I'll do two and a quarter for you if I took out the right spots. Thank you, human. I mean, I just wrote you down for it, Harry, but that's fine. I'll do that. You're right. Zilla. Zilla wins the points. I just gave it. That's what I was going to do, Jane. Zilla. Zilla, you care about the points or can Harrison have them? Well, Zilla won. If Zilla doesn't care, then it doesn't matter. I don't know. How, how much are they worth? What? How much is that worth? How much is 400 points worth? You don't have to email shipping. It's okay. I'll just give Zilla the... I, listen, the, the, I'm going to send you the points, and I'm just going to add credit to Zilla's account right now. Just tell me how much 400 points is worth, and I'll add it to Zilla's account right now. Because you already claimed the points. So just tell me how much 400 points is worth, and I'll add it to his account. Uh, we didn't, Hashemi, we pulled zero blacks in the entire first case. Zero blacks, no autos, and no auto, non-autos. I saw other people get so much more. I saw, I saw other cases where the blacks poured out. All right, so I just put 20 bucks on his account. So we're good. Harrison, congratulations. The points are yours. That's what I'm saying. Human, we didn't hit one in the whole case. It's ridiculous. What should I put up there instead of the pop sentry was super cool. We should do the pop sentry, man. Sixteen.
Hashemi, thank you. We pulled we pulled a we pulled a um two base autos or no a silver auto and a base auto of Diego Lopez. Silver and base. Would you say he's the number one chase in the product? Because we were we there was a debate the other day. There was a couple other people that people were saying were also the chase. Down, 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 down. Shara, yeah, it's those two. That's what they were saying. That was the debate. At least there's two really good ones. Let me see if anything else came up on that. I haven't seen a spitting venom yet. How rare are the spitting venom? Dude, the black the black spot we didn't hit any J and D. It's it's got it. We can't hit none again. Why is that spot six dollars, goat? Silver, ruby, and orange for the Winkle. I mean, we did pretty good with it in that last one. The uh, the cracked ice. I felt like we did pretty good there. Send 33, Winkle. One in 10 cases? Holy crap. We got to hit one, human. That's sick. Super non is off to McEwen. Black one of one non is off in the Prism 2 boxer. Sleeping Beauty to Jim, which is a good choice. Any of the lovely ladies is a, is a good choice in Disney. Can't really go wrong. And Black Auto, nice, in number three. Let's go. Black Auto is off, J&D. Good morning, Rat, Rat Boy. Hello. We're starting to get our wheels here. We're starting to snowball. Down the hill we go. Who wants one of these other spots in UFC? Disney is moving. Disney's pretty close, actually. Dude, that was a massive hit, Rat Boy. I, I can't believe we hit that. So I, I guess I just learned that, like, they're, 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 they're unnumbered, but there's only 50 in the print run, right? I think it goes to the Youthquake signature spot, but I'm not 100% sure. I need to verify. Somebody else asked me that. Let me see. Youthquake. Youthquake is its own autograph spot. Here's my question. Is the Youthquake... 
Regular youth quakes are refractors, right? I think they are. It might go to the refractor non. I feel like it should go to the... Eh. I got, I'm not sure where it goes. I'm going to ask. I'm going to find out. Wow, this is really close. I'm going to lose this. Oh, maybe I'm not. Can, can the game just end? Can the game just end, please? I have under 143. Oh, my God. If they hit a three-pointer, I'm going to lose. Oh, there's Big Meech. Okay, there you go. So it goes to the refractor non. Thank you, Big Meech. Big Meech does the... I got you, Vladdy. Uh, Big Meech does this... A Super Fractor Youthquake signature would go to the Youthquake spot. Right? Okay, got it. I think that's the, are there supers of like, wow, Efro, I had under, I had under 143, I had, we both won Efro, we middled it between the two of us. Are there super fractor non autos of like spinning venom? Like, can we hit a super fractor of a spinning venom, or is it just like an insert? Or what if there's like a super fractor of a UFC fight night? Would that go to the super non spot, or would it go to the UFC fight night spot? I assume that it would go to the UFC fight night spot, but I also assume there are no supers of the UFC fight night. Like, I know there's no supers of Let's Go or Hidden Gems. Yeah, I don't think they do either, Meech, but I'm just assuming. If any of those if any of the, those special insert spots have supers, then I would assume that they went to that specific spot. I think I understand. Yeah, I get it. Um, what's up, Dorson? Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Oh, my God. Western Kentucky is waxing Marquette. What is going on right now? This dude's got 17 points. Liberty, 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 Liberty. Wow, they're destroying them. Yes, Ice Cube. The black nun is off to the music. Got you, yep. We making music. Somebody kill NASCAR for me. $120 to kill NASCAR. Ready, watch this. I have an idea. Ready, watch this. I'm going to try something. One, two, three, four. 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 Watch this, okay? It's in the store for $153, okay? $30 a spot. 
Yep, I got you, Sherlock. $30 a spot. The top spot gets everything that's left in NASCAR. It's in there for over 150 bucks. It's in there for over $150. $30 a spot. The four spot filler. The top spot gets it all. Winner take all for 30 bucks. This is a winner take all on the NASCAR for 30 bucks. I actually think this is kind of fun. For basically the cost of the purple velocity spot, we can roll some dice and somebody can get like half the spots on the break on a kill for 30 bucks. Four spots, the top spot gets all the bacon. I think this is a fun little filler. It is fun, right? It didn't work, but it was a cool idea. I think so too. Kentucky screwed me too. No, those are, those are, I thought they had their own spot. I thought the Kings and Queens had their own spot, but I guess not. So they would go to the refractor non, yeah. No? Yeah, the refractor non-spot is really good. Yeah, well, it doesn't fly out. That's the key to it being a good insert. The key to any good inserts is uh, that, they, that they're not overprinting it. Yeah, I could go pick it up from uh, Legacy. One second.
Nice, human. Why is this not showing up? Driving me crazy. Sherlock, I think I refunded it. Three spots went back to your PayPal. And one spot went back in points. But I did it for you. You should be good. Damon is screaming. Damon is screaming. Is out of control. I'm watching him. He said, Ladies and gentlemen, I think we have a shield. I'm enjoying watching Damon, to be honest. What buyback, Harrison? They're fighting a buy. Uh, there's two fighters uh, in the championship fight coming up. They're doing a buyback. So their base cards are whoever wins. The base card's worth 20. Refractor's worth 40. Yes, he did, Thorson. Yes, he did. Yeah, the refractor spot gets forty per per card, and then and then the uh, yeah, and then the numbered cards are worth a lot too, like they're worth like a hundred, two hundred bucks each one of them. If it's if it's yeah exactly, if it's a green a green Pereira, and he wins, that's an it's a two hundred dollar card.
Oh, wow. That's sweet. One on one true shield. <laughs> I'm used to, I'm used to it even though I don't watch those videos. I'm a super fan. It's a nice looking card. His, he looks like he's constipated, Jandy. <laughs> What's the next break? All right, I'm done watching deck. That was a fun that was a fun hit. I enjoyed watching deck there. Constipated and proud is right. Base autos off. What's up, Chris? One on one shield auto, yeah. One second, they didn't give me napkins, my bad.
we're back. Baby, come back. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. No. I can't believe they they did him dirty like that, bro. Honestly, Fields is a good quarterback. I can't. Be, I I think Fields is a good quarterback. He wasn't the problem with that team, in my opinion. Fields is a good quarterback. I think their coaching sucks. Sorry, I apologize if you're a Bears fan. Their coaching is a freaking disaster. He, I completely agree. I completely agree. He was really like one of the very few good things about their team. He was the yeah him and more. Yeah, you know your shit. You know your you know your stuff. You know what you're talking about. I agree. I mean, it really it was him. He was really the bright shining spot. They all they had a couple receivers with some option. You know, I think he'll do. Uh, their coaching is a disaster too, though. Human, that's the problem. But but you know what they'll do? They'll they might be smart enough to at least run him into the ground, and and let and use him, even if it ruins his career. At least they'll use him. And, and he might actually do some damage. You might hear a lot about him for the next two, three years, then he might just disappear off the face of the earth. That's my opinion. He might pull a Michael Vick on everybody and just go, go bananas for two years and then just disappear. Three years. Two, three years. Because he's good, man. I agree, but, like, I always get so nervous with quarterbacks that are... Cause, cause he he's basically a running back. Yeah, he's like Cam Newton, but he's like, he's a better rusher than Cam was. Like Fields is legitimately like a freaking running back out there. He is massive. He is a big boy. Fields is legitimately like a freaking running back. He really is. That's so messed up, Efro. Are you kidding me? How dumb are they? They're going to give Miles Straw the starting gig over Chase DeLauder with his 2,000 OPS in spring training? Are they serious right now? That's so dumb. I hate it. I hate it. I know. I don't care. They should. He should be up now. It's not like the Guardians have like some. It's not like like they just don't want to pay him because he's a first rounder. They don't want to pay him right away. It's so dumb. He should be. He should be in the bigs to start the year. If I were a Guardians fan, I'd be pissed. I would love to see him, Jimenez, J Ram. That'd be that'd be a nice little that'd be a nice little if he gets it done, that'd be a nice top of the order there. His his numbers, I mean, I know that people don't care about spring training numbers, but Chase DeLauder's numbers in in this spring, they're not just good, they're stupid good. His numbers are ridiculous. He's got like four home runs. His OPS is like 1,800. He's got more walks than strikeouts. And the sample size is like 25, 30 at-bats. What, what more do you need? I don't understand. What else do you need? And why is Rat Tattooey still there? Michio, why is Rat Tattooey still there? Baby, come back. 
do 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 Yeah, refractor non-auto spot should probably be gone. In the UFC. The NASCAR. Somebody kill this NASCAR for me. A buck 20 to kill the NASCAR. That's a great deal. Somebody kill the NASCAR for 120. I think Minnie's going to go pick up some stuff from us from Legacy. All that Marvel and everything. She's going to go pick it up soon. I wonder if the Topps Chrome Update Sapphire or the Sterling showed up. Hold on, let me see if it showed up just now.
foreshadowing. NCAA, baby. NCAA. Cam Collier is... Is Cam Collier a bust? I'm going to say no. But he's not as exp as pricey and uh, spicy as people thought he was before. I think he's still a good a good maybe he's a good time to buy low on him. No, Kareem, I would never do that at work. <laughs> at the office, that's disgusting. Plus, I'm a married man, my friend. For now, at least. Until she throws me out. Who wants to kill the NASCAR for 120? Help me help you. Is that true, Kareem? That's what she said. Lion King, still there. Ratatouille, still there, onward. Moana. The Goofy Pluto spot is still there. Wow. Goofy Pluto spot is really good for 79. That's a good price. The price of the Disney stuff continues to go up. Alice in Wonderland is off to Lucky Mac. Love it. That's my PC right there. The Cheshire Cat. WWE 2 Boxer. Inching its way along. If anybody wants a spot, let me know. I'll take care of you. NASCAR Racing 3 Boxer. If somebody wants to kill, 120. It's a good kill price. It's in there for over 150. And then UFC The Hobby. Also slowly making its way there. One. A uh, two, a uh, one, two, three, four. Everybody to the dance floor. I think I'm just going to change this thing to a halfer.
Which one, Double D? The, uh... Do we have... Yeah, which F1? The Sapphire? The Dynasty, the Sapphire, or... What's up, Dave? Which one did you want me to put up on the screen? The Sapphire we have to change. I'm going to change it to a half case. I actually might do that right now. The F1 Tops Chrome we did the other day, the last break of that. Which F1 did you want to see? The Dynasty? Is it Winkle? I'm trying to refund this F1 Sapphire here. I just changed it to a half case break. Here it is. Nice. The Topps Chrome? I don't think we have any more. I think we're out of it, Double D. We're out of it. No, we don't, we did 40 cases. <laughs> we have more coming in, in like a few days, but we, we did 40 cases of it. We just ran out. I apologize, Double D. We literally did 40 cases of it, and we just ran out. Maybe more. We might have done like 45 cases.
How did you get banned? Did you try to did you try to use the VPIP or a v, uh, did you try to use a, a VPN? I mean. Right, I fixed that. I made it a half case. The uh, the sapphire. It says eighteen left. One, two, three, four. Done. 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 Okay, I fixed it. DraftKings is, I mean, DraftKings is, in a lot of ways, it's better. I want to do, like, another, oh, nice. I didn't see you say that, you, you did say that you wanted to see that Color Blast. Color Blast is off to the GOAT. Uh, I want to do another break or two, guys, but if we can't get it off, I'll just go pick that stuff up from Legacy and hop on baseball early, I guess. I can't do Dynasty, but I mean, I can hop on baseball early. Man, I love you guys, and I love being here. I wish we could open some packs right now. One, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. The NASCAR is so close. Is that the last? No, is it? No. Is that fresh? Is that a fr It is a freshie. The NASCAR is a freshie. When I was a teenager. All 
I'm so happy that Stroh's Volpe got a 10, man. I just watched that video, Harrison. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh my god, my brother's so funny. <laughs> it's so wrong. It all. I can't believe the tribute showed up before the update sapphire and the sterling. That's so crazy. That's so freaking crazy and ridiculous at the same time. How is that even possible? You are right. Marquette figured it out in the second half, Mr. Winkle.
What's up, Mr. Bass? Onward is off. And so is the blue. To $4.99 on the NASCAR. If anybody else would like a NASCAR spot, please let me know. It's a fresh case, three boxer. The purple velo spot is good because it has autos. The purple velo is the last spot here with autos here. You think they have any chance to win at all? Well, they couldn't have played that smart because they were down at halftime, but maybe playing fast is like a variance increaser, no? I don't really know basketball as well as I know poker and other sports and whatever, but like I feel like when you play fast, you're increasing variance. Like you could you could go on a run or you could or you could get a run gone on you, right? So maybe that's why they were, I mean, I don't know. I just feel like when you play fast, maybe increase variance, but that usually means they'll be like a fluky loss, but it also means they could have a fluky win. So... That's true, too. That's true, Winkle. That's true. That's true. That's true. It's Russian roulette. Yeah, no, it's, when you're losing, you're out. I mean, you're right, though. The mid-majors don't know how to conserve the, their energy for the later rounds, if needed. Yeah, but you could have a fluky win the same way you could have a fluky loss. For example, if they go up against a team that you know they're they're not as good at. Like like let's say they play Yukon, for example. They're probably not as good as Yukon. So but they could get fluke they could fluke their way into a win. It's not like, you know. I mean, Kentucky, that was embarrassing. It's all a factor, right, Noah? It's all a factor. 
You know what I might do? I might, I mean, I don't know. I want somebody to go pick us. We have this in the store, but it's not here, but it's, it's, it's here, but it's not here. You know what I mean? If you know what I mean? It's here, but it's not here. It's here, but it's not here. We can go pick it up real quick. Zero to 100 real quick. Seven spots left in the NASCAR. It's on the Scrizz. It's a freshy, fresh case. Yo, you need the keys? Nope. Oh, nice. That's amazing. So happy that I have that. It's fruit. You want some? It's just fruit. Don't pick at it. Use a fork. You want some? I know, because they don't send a fork. For the... I won't lose these, don't worry. I can't speak for Cindy, though. Eleven left in the next two boxer of WWE. Disney's down to 12. One, two, three, four. One, two. One, two. One, two, three, one. Disney's so close, man. Disney, NASCAR, they're both close. And the UFC is also kind of close, and I really want to see it. I just want to see stuff. I want to see cards. But we're not opening packs here. I might just go to Legacy and go pick up all this stuff and then just pop on baseball early. I know, Winkle, they're crushing. I made my money back from what I lost on Kentucky second half yesterday. UConn is crushing too, good lord.
Is there anything higher end non dynasty on baseball? PD? I mean, we got Sapphire. We got Bowman Draft Sapphire. That shit is fire. Let me look at what we have in the store for baseball. Bowman Draft Sapphire is super fire. And whenever we get it in stock, the Topps Chrome Update Sapphire is also fire. And same with the Sterling. The Sterling's pretty good, too. Inception is today, yeah. Inception releases today. Draft Sapphire is really good, PD. And the Topps Chrome Update Sapphire is also really good. I believe so, yeah. I believe so. I'll make sure I'll tell I'll call Mark to confirm. Say, I just want to let him know that I'll be there within the next thirty minutes or so. So I'm gonna let him there and go to Aladdin with him. That's perfect. I'll tell him right now. All right, cool. Thank you. Sixty five, seventy. No, that has to be a mistake. Yeah, the dynasty break, I know. I just told I just told him. Bowman draft sapphire is really good and Wyatt Langford made the team. His cards are gonna be if he if he produces if Wyatt produces in the in the regular season the first couple weeks my goodness his cards will have some serious serious nasa-esque liftoff i mean they've already gone up a ton but if he gets it done in the regular season his cards might go even more bonkers he's rising through the ranks just so fast I priced out the Inception without looking at anybody else's website. How did I do, Dave? The PYT. How does it look? No, Jackson's not making it, I know. Mm-mm. 
I have White Sox for two dollars. That is correct. I put the White Sox for two dollars. I had them at three, and I decided that was too high, and I lowered them to two. All they have is a Colson Montgomery base card. You're like the girl in uh, Willy Wonka, Zilla. And I want it now. <laughs> oh, come on. You guys, why are you guys ragging on? Then he'll complain that he'll complain that he didn't hit maybe. <laughs> oh, that's her name, right? Ver uh, Veronica or whatever. I think it looks good. Thank you, thank you. Looks fine. My, 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 my Sharona. Veruca? It's Veruca, not Veronica. Veruca Salt? Is that really her last name? Her last name is Salt? Is that true? Is that real? Veruca Salt? I don't remember. Sorry, John. I don't remember. Definitely Gene is the best Wonka. Wonka Wonka. Is it, uh, what's the name of that band, Dr Dram, that you were in, right? <laughs> we, what was it called? Weedus? Or what was it, what they called? Uh, Ween. Ween. Dram was the imaginary lead guitarist for the band Ween. <laughs> I know, Maggio. We saw that coming from a mile away. Meanwhile, my Cincinnati Reds, it's just injury after injury after injury. And it's becoming painful. I'm starting to feel the hurt. I know. I saw the Beetlejuice trailer. The Beetlejuice trailer looked good. Looks very good, actually. It, it's it'd be crazy to have anybody other than that what's her name girl as the as the the new Winona. Do 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 wasn't she like a compulsive shop lister, lifter or something? She is a klepto, right? Yeah.
She's also the Stranger Things mom, right? <laughs> I can fix her, says Dave. Dave, in a former life, his his number one his his his, his past job, his former career was turning hoes into housewives. He's gonna turn kleptos into <laughs> into nice young ladies that don't steal anything anymore. She's amazing in Stranger Things. She's actually a really great actress. As an actress, I'm a, I'm a fan. Of her stealing things from stores, I'm not a fan. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. I asked Maggio if he wants to kill NASCAR. He he went into, he hid in a corner. <laughs> oh, there he is! Yes, Maggio. Maggio. The answer is a hundred and six. Whoa. No less. Send a hundred, Maggio. I I love you. Send a hundred. The Beetlejuice trailer is good, right? Base to Michio, you got it. Base to Michio. Red to Iwasi. Orange to Karim. That's a good spot. I like the orange spot. Yeah, Michael Keaton is so good. I'll send you something funny, Dave. You'll laugh. My friend sent me this. He always, he just loves the comments. <laughs> don't, yeah. Don't share it with the chat. I don't want to get canceled, Dave. All right, let's do these. It's a freshie. He looks like one, Dave. Wasn't the guy from uh, Modern Family? Or is that a different actor? The Stone Street guy or whatever that guy? Is that, was he in? Shake, 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 it all. Shake your body like work, 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 it work, 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 All right, I'm putting the next one in the store. I love Ferris Bueller's Day Off is one of my favorite movies.
Thank you, Maggio. 2023. Panini. Prism. No, 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 NASCAR. Three bucks. Pick your color. Number 17. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Twenty twenty three Panini <coughs> Racing. Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Three boxes. Three boxes. Let's go up here. Let's go up here. One. Let's do a pillar. Let's do a one pillar. Two. And the third box in the pillar, if it wants to come out. Hold on. I might have to remove a couple other ones just to get it out. There it is. Three. Dark side of the moon. Pick your color 17 is here. I immediately see a hit from Maggio on the kill coming your way. Coming your way hot. Thank you, Maggio, for the kill. Let's hit a black. Let's hit a gold vinyl. Let's hit something big. Wow, Maggio, you got the white spot? This is, um, we hit a Joey Logano white auto to five. In the last case. Wow, that's a good card. Let's go. This is a good product, man. They don't make that much of this stuff, so there's everything is kind of low numbered, and I like that feeling. I like that feeling. When everything is low numbered, it feels good. Cause it feels so good. That's a good color too. We're getting a lot of good color here. I told you, Dave, they're gorgeous. I like the I like the blue cracked ice also. The Carolina blue ice. The Carolina blue ice and the blue scope are, are both really nice. It's kinda it's kinda cool that the Carolina uh, the Carolina blue ice. One of the things that I would say makes it like an inch nicer or more special than like a regular sapphire is just because ooh, another hit by the Maggio is because uh, they don't have a zillion different cracked ice colors like if there was a red ice and a green ice and this ice and that ice and all these ice then if everything was iced up then the Carolina Blue Ice wouldn't do it for me, even though it's a gorgeous color. 
then I would just care about the Carolina Blue Scope. But because there's no other ice, there's regular cracked ice, and there's Carolina Blue Ice, and that's all the ice that she wrote. And for that reason, I like it in this product. Extra nice. Extra nice ice. If I hear ice one more time... They're all getting hit on on live. Bok choy. I was doing the math earlier. I think there's 22 of them. Bok choy, you gonna join me for some Inception? Wow, Maggio, you're a genius. Got, I think you got some sweats here, Maggio. I saw the Otani. I saw the one big Otani get hit. It's a Maggio. Oh, yeah, I'm not worried about it. Just remember, guys, nobody does more Dynasty than Blez. It's not even close. Nobody does more Dynasty than Blez. I see a really good card right away. Wow. Maggio, are you here? Maggio, you got some sweats, kid. I hope you're here. Good luck. You got Maggio, Maggio, Maggio. You have some sweats, bro. In this handful alone, you have a disco and a zebra. Good luck. Haley Deegan on the blue. The blue is there late, golfer bass. And then Nemchek, he's going to be our disco to 75, Mr. John Hunter. And then you got a zebra. Behind a silver. Ty Gibbs. Wow, it's actually really good. Blaine Perkins, rookie. We'll take it. Blaine Perkins, rookie zebra. That's pretty good. Zebras are really hard to hit, man. Congrats. Nice hit. Silver. Busher on the silver auto. Silver auto to the bass. Earnhardt Jr. on the red. Unnumbered there. And then Justin Haley on the blue and red hyper. I think the 299. Silver of Kozlowski. Oh, Corey, don't jump. Silver of Josh Berry and the orange reactive of Algier. I think that goes to Karen. 75th of Tony Stewart, silver of Casey Kane, and wow. That's Jeff Gordon. And it's Carolina Blue Ice to 25. That's a nice card, man. PD. PD gets a banger. Jeff Gordon to 25. Carolina Blue Ice. That is gorgeous. We hit a gold of, Je of Jeff Gordon in, a pre in an earlier break. That's the second best Gordon we've hit in this whole run. Purple Velo coming up. Oh, Purple Velo Auto, and I literally called it. I said one of the sneaky things about the purple velo spot 
is that it has autos, and I think they're numbered to like 49, maybe, maybe even lower. 99, excuse me, 99. Purple Velo to 99 with ink, it's Cole Moore. Normally the spot is numbered higher, so. The fact that it even has autos, that's great. Anderson on the red, and we have a red, white, and blue auto now. Of Casey Kane. Casey Kane, red, white, and blue to 35. 24 of 35 with the patented penmanship ink. I did, right, Goat? I said that we were going to hit a purple velo auto. I literally said, I was like, oh, the only spot left with ink. It's the purple velo spot. <laughs> Let me just sleeve and do our thing and reset tight for a sec. No, Dram, there's no we're not breaking dynasty today. There will be no dynasty broken. Oh, sorry. Tony Stewart red. There'll be no dynasty broken today. Sunday, though, will be nuclear. You guys will have a blast on Sunday. It'll be like, it'll be like, you know, like, just, just the, the weight, the suspense. You guys will have a great time on Sunday with Backer and Cat. All right, let's continue. Ooh, a championship trophy of Tony Stewart. These are tough hits. Noah. Exactly, Dave. Yeah. Tony Stewart on the champ trophy. And then the king, Richard Petty on the blue. And Chris Busher on the purple velo. That purple velo spot is doing work. I think I see an auto coming up in the form of a redemption, maybe? Top loaders. Riches and Dale are at that. Are they at that show? They're at the car, they're at a card show, right? Riches and Dale, maybe some others too. What's up, Bacon Wrapped? How you doing? Bacon wraps. He's bacon wrapped. Bacon wrapped in the house. All right, here we go. Let's keep going. Silver of Alex Bowman. And a redemption. A rookie stripe. Signature Prism, Rookie Stripe Signature Prism, Raja Karuth, Rookie Stripe Signature Prism, I believe that is a silver. Can somebody confirm the Rookie Stripe? 
Sil Signature Prism is a silver looking card? I believe that is. I believe that goes to the best, but if I could get a confirmation. Nick Sanchez on the green reactive and Ty Gibbs red and blue hyper. Colby Howard orange reactive for the Karam on the Karam Karma. Silver of Chandler Smith, Sheldon Creed, orange reactive back to Karam. We have another, another one. Ooh, patented penmanship of Haley Deegan. Haley Deegan, that's definitely going to the best. I think they're both going to the best. Rookie Stripe Signature Prism. I think it's just the name of, like, the auto. I think I'm pretty sure it's... A lot of stuff is, Ted, yes. Um, Minnie went to pick it up right now. She should be at Legacy right now, picking stuff up. Chase Elliott on the red. Throwback Silver of Harvick. Jake Drew on the on the blue rookie, and then Suarez, your third purple velo. Disco coming up. Disco Fever. Let's go dancing, Maggio. Leo Sayer style. Kyle Larson on the blue, and Corey Heim. We're going dancing with Corey Heim. You make me feel like dancing. Want to dance the night away. Silver of Heim again, and then Danny Hamlin on the National Pride Silver Peace. Rookie stripes are only checkered flag and lower? Is that what you're telling me right now? Rookie stripes are only checkered flag and lower? What is the signature prism? I don't think they're right. I think they can come silver. That just says sig signature prism. I think that... I think that's a silver. It says rookie... Stripe signature prism. Card number three. Raja Karu. I just don't think that's numbered to 50 or lower. The problem is, if it's number, what is it numbered to? Yeah, that's just what's listed. They're not including the base. They just didn't list the base because there's no number on it. That's what I think. I'm leaving it. I'm, I'm giving it to Vess. I think that's correct. Because it doesn't specify another color. Ooh, that definitely does specify another color. Cole Custer on the checkered flag to 50 with ink. Yeah, if eBay has silver, then it's definitely silver. Thank you, Goat. Cole Custer with a nice card here. Checkered flag to Ed on the ink. <laughs> Colby Howard, blue and Truex Jr. on the blue and red hyper. Dram, it was my college girlfriend's favorite song. Harrison Burton on the silver. That's how I discovered it in the first place. 
Austin Wayne Self, silver, and then a kaleidoscope, silver of Suarez. 75th Annie Auto of BJ McLeod. McLeod? Is it McLeod or McLeod? McLeod, McLeod right? McLeod? No number like a horse with no name. Going to Mr. Moore. Very sloppy, Dave. It's just Panini in general. Damon was telling me how the checklists are not coming out correctly or on time or anything like that on all the football products as well. And I'm guessing it's similar on the basketball. Dale Jarrett, Green Reactive, and Hunter Nemechek on the blue and red Hyper. What do we got here? What do we got here? Huh? Orange Reactive of Hamlin. That's a good card for Karen. 75th Annie of Casey Kane and then a silver of Jimmy Johnson. Hyper Blue and Red, William Byron, and we have a rainbow coming up. Rainbow Auto of Kyle Petty. Wearing his Mellow Yellow Finest. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Kyle Petty Rainbow Ink for Ed. That's pretty cool. They call me Mellow Yellow. <coughs> Excuse me, and then Haley Deegan behind. One more box. What's in the box? We're going to find out. Last box, and there's some spice in here, too. I saw when I was opening these packs, there's good color all throughout the place. Silver of Elliot. Silver of Burton, and then Eric Jones on the orange reactive to Karim. Uh, got red, white, and blue here. Red, white, and blue of. Wow. King. It's the King. Richard Petty on the red, white, and blue auto to 35. Nine out of 35. That's a great picture of him, too. Fire card for Laguna Beach. It's so funny. I told Laguna Beach that he does better when he doesn't watch. I want him to watch, but it's funny. We've been killing it for him when he's not paying attention. Laguna Beach gets Richard Petty, red, white, and blue. Sensational signature to 35, and it really is a beautiful card. That is a banger. Love it. Two red, white, and blue autos in this break so far. That is a very spicy piece. Absolutely gorgeous. We're not done, though. We ain't done. Jack Wood on the red rookie. And jackpot. It's Jimmy Johnson. Ooh, we have cracked ice, Carolina style. Of Brandon Jones. Brandon Jones beat Jones. On the Carolina blue ice. There won't be Mr. Papa Giorgio. It'll be Sunday with Backer and Cat. There will be no dynasty today.
There'll be Inception, and there'll be other fun stuff, but no Dynasty. I apologize. That'd be pretty funny, Dram. <laughs> Oh, nice. Sweet. Yeah, there might be, yeah. Uh... Carolina Blue Scope behind the Blue Sheldon Creed of Jeb Burton. This is my favorite parallel in the product. The Carolina Blue Scope, gorgeous. Laguna Beach again. Different parallel, same recipient. We got more spicy color coming up, though. Who's got that spot? Ooh, ooh, a new recipient. Brandon Jones, Silver Cole Custer on the Silver Fractal. We have a 75th auto of Jamie McMurray. And then we have a Sheldon Creed and an Algier. Silver of Jeff, Jeff Burton, different Burton. And then Nemechek on the Prismatic Silver. A couple more handfuls left. It's staring at me, so I'm just going to show it. The 75th of uh, Richard Childress. Looks like Robin Williams. Is it just me? Or does he look like Robin Williams? Well, I think there's 22 of them, Papa Giorgio. Don't worry. She has everything. Wow, red and white and blue autograph of Carl Edwards, your third red, white, and blue auto of the break. Laguna Beach. How you doing? Carl Edwards on the red, white, and blue auto to 35. Absolute smash. Three hits. Jack Wood, green reactive. Hamlin on the car, blue and red hyper. And Which one's Lord the Kano. one Lorcano? The Kakawao, I think it's Star Wars. We need to find out. I I'll look and see. Yeah, I think it's Star Wars. Thank you. Thank you. Hamrick on the orange reactive. We got one Lorcana and we got two Kakawao. I think the Kakawao is Star Wars. Yeah, both Star Wars. Okay, cool. Thank you. Silver on Chase Briscoe. Bubba. Mr. Wallace on the purple velo. That spot did well on this break as well. Uh, and then Jeremy Clements on a sensational SIG. Denny Hamlin on the red in the back, but sensational SIG to 50 of Jeremy Clements for Ed. Okay, you don't want it? Okay. Got it. Maggio doesn't want the Bubba. Does anybody, who wants the Bubba? Does anybody want Bubba? They can have it for free. Maggio doesn't want it. Clements to 50 on the ink there. Let me sleeve stuff up. Let me know if I have any takers on the Bubba Wallace Purple d -Lo. It is free shipping, Dad Tip. That's fair. I'll put it in your pile, Dad Tip. Do they know? Dad Tip, do they know? Do they know, Dad Tip? Can I tell them? Do you want to tell them? Can I tell them? Just like the location, like the fact that you're that you're very close, to say the least. Oh, okay. You don't care if I say then. Yeah, D Dad. Dad Tip is in the office. We, 
he, he's in the same building as us. Just the dad tip is in the office upstairs from us. There's only a few companies in this office. So when dad tip says, just throw it in my pile, it's free shipping. He's literally upstairs. <laughs> He's just upstairs from Blez. So it's literally free shipping because it ain't no shipping at all. I could walk upstairs and hand it to the dad tip right about now. <laughs> I don't know, but I'm sure Maggio has his reasons. I mean, Bubba made a pretty big stink during the COVID stuff, no? It is pretty damn convenient, dad tip. Oh my God, did Noah, wait, did we send that Bubba? Oh my God, I think we sent, didn't we? Or did we send it, no, to Noah. Maggio hit something and he sent it to Noah? Or did Noah hit something and send it to Maggio? Noah, didn't we hit a Bubba Wallace auto and you had me send it to Maggio because you thought he collected it? I think that happened. I'm pretty sure that actually happened. One, one way, it went one way or the other. Oh, it was the other way. Okay, Maggio hit it. Maggio sent something to you, Noah. Uh, that's not, maybe. Okay. <laughs> All right, recap. I'll put the bub on the side. Don't worry. Here's the recap. The numbered stuff. more numbered stuff. Larson's his guy? Nice. Yeah, it was a redemption for sure. Richard Petty to 35 with ink. I'll beat the sword on all three of those red and white and blue autos for you, Mr. Laguna Beach. And then the Carolina Blue Scope, I guess I'll throw that in there. Brandon Jones on the Cracked Ice, Jeff Gordon on the Carolina Blue Cracked Ice, Kyle Petty on the Rainbow Auto to 24. We had some other stuff here. I guess in no particular order. We had the Rookie Stripe Signature Prism Auto of Roger Carruth for the Bass, Haley Deegan Patented Penmanship Prism Auto for the Bass, Busher Silver Auto for the Bass, Childress 75th, McMurray, on the 75th auto, Jimmy Johnson on the jackpot, Tony Stewart, 75th, Casey Kane, 75th, BJ McLeod on the 75th auto. So the 75th spot did very well, Mr. Moore. Harvick throwback silver championship trophy of Stewart for Noah and Blaine Perkins on the zebra, which is a very tough hit for Maggio. That was three boxes of NASCAR Panini Prism Racing, and honestly, that was a pretty damn good three boxes. And we have nine left. That was a fresh, freshie. So pick your color 17 in the books, but the rest should be pretty good too. Thank you for joining. Appreciate the kill, Maggio. That was the break.
I put the Lorcana in the store. There's we have one case. We got one case of it. What's up, Ted? We're, well, she's going to add some stuff to the store in a minute. We're working on that right now. Let me just beat the sort on these few cards here for Laguna Beach. I just added a Lord Connor to the store, and we have two cases of Star Wars Kakawow, Ted. We're going to add that to the store soon. The Marvel Platinum as well. We'll end up going crazy on Monday. Yes, sir. We may. It, I'm not sure how much we'll get around to today. I'm going to try to add with many as much as we can, but if we don't get around to stuff today, then Monday will be a party day. We'll get buck wilds. You going to take your son to a race, Noah? You probably already have. I'm guessing you've already taken him to some races. Oh, I didn't take a picture of this Richard Petty. Whoops. Gorgeous card. Why didn't I take a picture? Damn it, why didn't I concur? All right, don't worry, Maggio. That uh, dad tip will get the other one. Wow, Marquette Western Kentucky went under 146, 150 or 156. Wow. It went under by a point, no shit. No way. What a dream. The purple velo is a nice color, Dad Tip. I think it's a beautiful color. The ve velocity, they don't have the velocity in uh They don't have the velocity in 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 Tops products like that. It's different. Second guts. Where is this thing?
here we go. Done with that. Let's update everything else that we got on the Scriz. No movement on the Disney from last time. Prism, WWE, the library has taken the teal spot, which is my favorite parallel. Every time I show anybody in person all the parallels, the gold and the teal look by far the nice, the nicest for the WWE. The teal spot is, is a steal. The teal spot is a steal. Eighteen is almost full for NASCAR. Buyakasha. It is. We just did that last break. I want to do the next one now. Carolina Blue Scope is there. What? I agree, Dad Tip, a hundred percent. I agree a hundred percent. And I'm gonna be here to see it happen and make it happen. I'm gonna facilitate that bad boy. Reactive orange, red, both good spots. Oh, you know what I forgot to do today? For upload videos, huh? Upload videos. Ichthyr the Demon. Is that Jim Carrey, Ace Ventura? Ekthertha the Demon. All right, those last videos are uploading. Who wants a spot in the NASCAR? Let's do it, boys. Let's do another NASCAR break. That was really fun. I want to run it back. We just did some really good stuff. Maggio, who do you want the who do you want to get the base spot? You can have the base spot for free. I know you don't want the base though, so gift it to someone. Who do you want the base spot for? Michio, Karim, Iwasi? I wa okay. Michio. Michio gets the base. Who, who wants another spot in NASCAR? The Carolina Blue Scope only hit one card in that first three boxes. It's such a good buy. The Carolina Blue Scope is like such a good buy right here. It's such a good buy. Reactive Green is kind of a good buy too. It's to 99 and the autos are to 75, PD. It's a really good spot. It's the beaut most it's it's the prettiest parallel number 1 and number 2 we only hit one one break one card of it in the, in the last break. It's going to hit. 
Like, it's gonna hit. It's It should get some love, even in a three-box break. It should get at least one hit. Maybe two. It could get, like, four. We just hit three red, white, and blue autos to 35. Carolina blue scope is to 99. We got one. I'm going to take it out for you, Ted, if it's still there. I got it out for you, Ted. You can take it. <coughs> I can't do a discount on that spot because it's guaranteed to hit. But if it doesn't hit, I'll hook you up, Ted. We have, have, I have, have a been? yeah. Okay, cool. I was yeah. just saying, because there's like six cases it's, over there. You, you know, that that's, from? that's, uh. It's just been sitting there forever, because Instagram did it, like, here and there. I know. That's, that's, you know what happened with that is, that's Tiffany Stratton's, mm -hmm. she, that she's the chase. I know nothing about that either, man. Tiffany Stratton, uh, bro, uh, he, like, Braun Breaker, there's like a few, but like, that's the 22. She, and it's the, expensive? It is. Oh, so that's the problem. Like it's yeah, it's not okay. cheap. I mean, it's not like it's like this. These are two boxers of it. Like we're doing two boxers of it, and like a lot of the more expensive spots are already taken. Yeah, that would be yeah. Like it's it's pricey. At two boxes. Also. Yeah, at two boxes. But so it's just gonna move slower. That's why I was. Yeah, but her one of one is yeah, still out there. It's like. Well, yeah. Sit in one of these cases. Let's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I know. Let's get to it, people. I know we've been. We just did it. Yeah, we did one of it early. It's it's really good. It's very very good. It's actually like way higher end than I thought it was gonna be. That's you can take. I don't care. Take them all. We don't need. We don't get to sell those. I have a collection so far. I have the Spider Man and I have Disney and I have this. Yeah, I think I think you were the one that asked me to save those, right? No. Somebody asked I me to save those. I think Blue probably said. Blue? I think I maybe said it, but they're I mean, nice, you right? You originally said it when I came on one day. You said we were saving. They do them. look really nice. Let me see. Yeah, these are cool. Right? I like the. I like, I like the, the pictures. The collages of all the Star Wars. Stuff. I like the. I like the hologram. The Taco Bell hologram. So this I love is cool the stuff. The fact that we, we like that comes from overseas is cool. I, I, I also like, like how see. every box is numbered. Oh, that's cool. Wait, right? actually, I might look at the numbers. Yes, there you go. I get a cool number. Every box is numbered. Isn't that sweet? I think that's... Oh, we have, like, so different numbers. I love that they do that, by the way. Oh, I wish that I wish that every product did that. That would be cool. They should do that. It should be, like... It would make for a better team. I mean, look, I'm not like I'm not the I'm not the law. I'm not the I'm not the sheriff in these, you know. But like, the same way that like, I mean, here I'll mute I'll mute it.
golden. I know, it's like a golden wow. like 3D hologram. That's cool. That's my favorite part about it. Okay, thank you. Of course, thank you. NASCAR is so close. So close. Purple Velo is off to the Zilla. Let's go. Ted, you're good. Thank you. We're right there. It's not black. It's like blue. It's like a, it's actually like a nice blue. This, this is the best one. It's like a blue with gray. This part is black and gray, but then on this side, it's blue, blue, gray, blue, gray. Ha 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 ha, Zilla. That would be a dupe if you did. This 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 is the best hoodie. It's relatively new. I give I give Blez credit. They don't when they get their clothes, their their clothes are really nice. All the Blez clothes is really comfortable and really nice. Wow, this guy, Chad Baker Mazzara, got thrown out of the game. Flagrant, too, for his elbow. He usually gets some buckets. He had 25 points against Georgia. That's not good. I guess he gets hyped up for the big games. Purple Haze is awesome. I miss him. I hope he's okay. His clothes are great. He did a great job. Tell him I say hello and I miss him. Eleven dollars a spot, two for nineteen, top six draft. Little filler for the NASCAR. Let's see if we can fill this NASCAR with a little baby filler. Eleven dollars a spot, two for nineteen. Eleven a spot, two for nineteen, a three box PYC of NASCAR. We also have the Lorcana in the store. Lorcana's in the store. It's down to eight. Did Aaron hang out? No. Oh, we were still actually down to eight. Yeah. Somebody fixed it, something, because it blows better now, like in the rest of the building. But yeah, it's I don't feel it. There's no air coming out, but there's the intake, so you hear it because it's sucking the air out of the room. Oh, that's but bizarre. yeah, it sucks the air I'm out. Getting any flow. But there's no yeah, no air comes in. But it's weird because like, in a weird 
No, because like in a weird way, it's still a vacuum because if it's sucking the air out of the room, it's still sucking the cool air into the room from the rest of the office. True. Yeah, so so you it's get like, that, like not the worst ever. Ish. Yeah, it's not like it's not like a mm-hmm. hundred degrees. Right. Although, so worst, although what's gonna happen is, like, what happens is if when it's nice outside and it's hot, and that door is open because people are like moving things inside and out, and then the air comes in. Then it then it's then it's I'm sauna. screwed. Then it's hot as shit. Yeah. It are it's been hot before in the past year. Very hot. Like very, very hot. Very, very hot. Lorcana's flying in the store, guys. Lorcana's flying. We can do Lorcana. Oh, are you gonna um where you are, do you wanna add oh did you get this? Did you get the pop century? Did they give you any of that stuff or no? No. Did you need that? Yeah. Of course. Yeah, I can he, go back. Well, no, we I don't need it. To, nothing to do today, so. I mean, if you want, you can, but we don't need it for today. Um, okay, then I can go this weekend. That's fine. That we need, we need the, the leaf. Write down what we need, because so well, he had. I, I walked in. No, here I'll tell you a story. I walk in. It's Tan Man and somebody else working behind the counter, right? They had no idea what I was coming for. Tan Man kind of knew. He's like, oh yeah, there was a pile, kind of, sort of, whatever. He gives me the three, right? I happen to catch Mark on the way out the door. I'm okay. Like, Good, cool. So I said, what am I missing? And he says, just a Laura Connor shirt. I said, that's it. He said, that's it. <laughs> so he even double-checked. <laughs> yeah, no, Leaf Met... No, there was, like, a bunch of other stuff. Leaf Metal Pop that's Century. I said it was... So you made it seem like a lot of stuff. Well, he called... Mark called me, and he read me a list of things, and it was, like, five or six things. Weird. He might um, have gotten confused. He probably maybe forgot. They sold it we spoke at, like, late. We spoke late at night. Um, Either way, come up with a list of what we're getting from Lexi and text it to me at some point. Or drop it in a pop chat somewhere. Just do something with it. So we make sure it was Pop Century, and then it was another Marvel product that I didn't hear that I didn't know about. I was the, for my first time hearing about it that he like mentioned, a new Marvel like a new product Marvel that he, he I didn't know about. Century. Yes, okay. he he said I, he had two cases of it for me. Perfect. So I'll jot that down and make sure. Two. That ca- I, I don't remember what it was called, but it was like a new Marvel product. Cool. And then. It's not this, right? The Marvel Platinum. No. Okay. No. And then this. He only has one left of this. He put it on the side for me. This leaf metal pop century, the one on one proof thing. Okay, cool. Same so one as last time. One leaf pop century. Yeah, that's he'll yeah. He'll know which one it is. Yeah, just tell him for sure. Leaf. There's obviously a million different types. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. The leaf metal pop century. He knows for sure which one. I know for yeah. He definitely knows which one. And then two cases of a new Marvel thing. Yes, and then yes, and then there's something else too. I'm forgetting. I know there was like a bunch. I'm telling you, he like had a list. Is that it? Hold on, Dave's giving me a link. Let me see if that's the new one. Oh, okay, nice. Um, I don't remember the name of it. And then there's also, you got the Kakawao. I got the Kakawao, the Lorcana, and the... Um, there, and then there's also the, the Marvel Disney, or the uh, the Disney... Uh, see, I thought there was like three different types of Kakawao, you said. One of them's not out yet. There's oh, That's okay. the fourth one. That's the fourth one coming out. Right, but we Is only this, got one type so far. I know, but we should, we sh- there's others. We should be, I'm, like, I Jared... Know. Should be. I thought he got him. I thought he ordered it, but. Well, you work tomorrow? No, tomorrow. So why don't we just go to Lakeview That's tomorrow? That's fine. I'll go tomorrow. That's fine. Pick everything up, and then I'll just bring it back to the office, put it away, and stuff. You can go home and do whatever. I'm in. Yeah, I'm down. So I'll do it. Whatever time you that need sounds to. good. That'll work. That's perfect. Yeah, they want Marvel Platinum. If whenever you put that in there. Nice. There we go, Sherlock. Now the half's in the store. And by the way, the the guy who took the full case spot, he'll end up taking a couple spots in the half case or two, Sherlock. So hopefully that helps it move a little faster. There's a chance that the Marvel goes in the store today, Ted. But the Star Wars... Actually, the Star Wars is Kakawao, right? I actually might be able to put that in the store today. I like the second one better than the first one. What do you guys think? Although the second one looks like spaceships and stuff. I don't know. That looks Star Wars-y. 
Which one do you guys like better? I can read the word leaf better on the first one. But people are going to look at that and they're going to be like, who are these famous people? I don't know these famous people. The second one I think is better. Yeah, make more. I'm going to see if the Kakawao. No, he doesn't, Dad, but he uses the AI just to make some random ones sometimes. And we've been using them because I like him. He's very nice for doing it. All right, Phantom Disney. I think this is five bucks. We can do this. No, that's the Kakawao Phantom Disney. I'm adding the Kakawao. How many cases did I get of the Kakawao? I got two I got two cases of the Kakawao and one of the Lorcana. I added the Kakawao to the store, the Star Wars. I added it, Ted. I did it I added it again. Just now. I like that last one for the record. Don't worry about it. Once all came, he reminded me of another cigarettes. They did it with cigarettes too. Cigarettes? What? Yeah. They did it with cigarettes and they did it with like THC. I already told you that. I said cigarettes did and you alcohol. Say cigarettes? Yeah. Oh, I didn't hear you. Yeah, say cigarettes no. and alcohol. And I heard you yeah. say alcohol and then I heard you say THC. Those are the original two. Those, those, well, are the, those are the yeah. those are the big two. It was just two. so funny because what a coincidence that we were talking about that and then somehow we went into that conversation. It was just it was prohibition in the 1920s. Alcohol, yeah. What a coincidence. Yeah, do you, here. The conversations go right I'll, after I'll you. And you already, I'm sure you know this, but you. what's crazy is the, you realize that there's the one group in the, the governmental or whatever organization that's in charge of the tobacco is also in charge of the guns. It's called tobacco and firearms. Oh, it's the yeah. Same, but it's like, yeah, but it's like the dumb, like how much sense does that make? None. Like what the... What 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 the hell does tobacco have to do with guns? It's like the dumbest thing. It's like it is because like alcohol it's so sugar. ridiculous. It's so ridiculous. It's so ridiculous. It's because that they're all they, all three of them are the same, and like you know, some some could argue a necessary evil, but the bottom line is the government makes tons of money off it, so they tax them all three: guns, and and alcohol and booze. It's, yeah, yes, they are. Yeah, the government is nuts. <laughs> they want you to change your name. I 
I like that May the Force Be With You spot. That's a good spot. We're so close on the NASCAR. So close. So close to me. Um, I'm going to be right back. I have to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back.
Yo, yo, what's up, Kelly? We are back. It is Brittany, and I am back. <laughs> yeah, they definitely do. They they need to like start fresh somehow, Noah. But like, in a weird, in like you know, I don't know. In a way that makes sense. The Kakawao is flying. I put Kakawao in the store. There's, I'll link you guys to the Star Wars. This is the first break. There's another one in the store too, though. There's two of them. Um, and then there's also Lorcana. Which I linked to you guys there. Marvel Platinum we're going to add as soon as possible. I am Zilla, yes, sir. I'll be over there in about 90 minutes. Hopefully we can get a couple more breaks off over here first. Currently working on fixing the store with a couple a couple spots. All right, sweet. That's perfect. Now, 20. Eight, there we go, perfect. That's fixed. F1 Sapphire is also in this store. Random driver with one combo spot and some other fun spots. Highly recommend getting into that. That's a very elite product. 16. I put another WWE Prism Hobby two boxer, just the last two of the case. 16 and 17 are the last two of the case.
What's up, Mr. Young? Baseball will be on in about uh, 80 minutes. I'll be shifting over to that room in about 80 minutes. We'll probably get more, Kelly. We'll probably get more. What's up? <coughs> mm -hmm. You let me know what you need, John. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, <coughs> yeah, I can do that. You haven't been refunded for it yet, right? Yeah, no, I got you, John. That's fine. I can give you the points. That's fine. I got you right now. Of course, man. You already had some points on your account, I think. Yeah, you did. You should be good. You should be good. I just took care of it for you. You have a bunch of points in your account now. You had a few bucks on there before. Now that was an expensive spot in Sterling, as you know. So you... You, you did, right? I think that makes sense, yeah. I think you, you might not be the only one that did that. I took care of it for you. Your points should be all set. Good. Best of luck on Dynasty. Backer will be doing that on Sunday with Cat as his number two. You guys will have a ton of fun ripping Dynasty. It's going to be unbelievable. Backer Backer got a lot of Dynasty for us. You know how You know how big we go on Dynasty. It's very important to us. Dynasty is our Dynasty is probably like the number one for Blez. I mean, I know we do a lot of Bowman. More Bowman than anybody. We do more Bowman and we do more Dynasty. We do more of like everything. Anything that we do. What do you mean you missed the player breaks? We have two player breaks. Yeah, on Monday I'll probably rip Dynasty. I don't know, whenever they throw me on the schedule, Zilla, I'll do it. Except today. <laughs> Today is not Monday, Zilla. Really, John? They will after he has a good year this year. I would expect Harris to do good. No, don't worry. I don't need a manicure goat. I'm good. I'm good. I have, I feel like, honestly, I mean, you guys could be the judge. I don't know. You guys, you tell me. I feel like I have I have reasonable I have clean nails. No, these are clean. 
I don't have to go. I don't, do I need a manicure? I feel like my nails are legit. For a, 40, a 41 and a half year old man, I feel good about the, my nails. I feel like they look good. I have the cuticle butter from Lush, but I haven't used it in a while. I gotta use it, otherwise they look good, right? Come on. Yeah, the long skinny fingers. I, those are piano playing hands right there. That's what I'm saying, that's what I'm saying, Ted. I'm pr I have I have feel like my hands are uh Listen, I'm not Brad Pitt, but I'm like I'm like David Duchovny. And what's that movie where he's the hand model and he's got his hand encased in glass? <laughs> I'm like David Duchovny, the hand model. <laughs> Zoolander, yes. <laughs> That's a good one. I'll use that one, Dave. You don't like breakers with fangs, Dave? David Duchovny is a very, very much a ladies' man. <laughs> or are we talking about the Durango? Durango. Where did these go? Oh, here it is. Ba la 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 Bang, looks good, Dave. Looks good. David Duchovny, if you've never seen Californication. Prism's down to six. Somebody say kill. Disney's down to 11. Did a movie come off when I wasn't looking? You got it. You got it, Maggio. Give me one second. Let me just fix the Disney. Winona. 40, let's see. Who do you want to give the blue spot to? Noah? Let's give it to Noah. Noah Noah's going to get the blue spot. 
I gave Iwasi Eerie? Okay, Eerie. Never mind. Eerie. That's a good idea, actually. Sorry, Noah. Nah, that's all right. Noah, Noah, what, it's up to you. Noah's got teams in this already. He's got the silver. He's going to get some hits. We're going to hit for Noah. We're a hitter for Noah. We'll give Eerie. Let's get Eerie involved. We'll give him the blue. Noah doesn't mind. All right, now Maggio did him more than his part, guys. Maggio did more than his part. It's time for us to do a little baby filler here. Maggio did his part. I'm going to send the damn email. This is for the NASCAR. Three boxes of it. Six dollars a spot. Two for ten. The top three draft. It's a ten spot filler. We can do this, guys. Two for the block man. Now we're talking. There we go. Six left. It's gonna go. Four left. Two for the bass. Bass is a loyal member of the Bless Pop community here. Two for James, and like that, we were down to the last two. Who wants the last two? I'll add another break of this to the store. That's fine, Dave. Full. That's fine. There's no rush, Dave. I'm here all night. I'm at the, you know, I'm at the, I'll be on the baseball channel. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Maggio. Yeah, yeah, you can send. You guys can send, absolutely. We also got more Spider-Man No Way Home, but I want to fit. I want to tweak the spots a little bit. There's a couple spots that we that we never added. There's like numbered spots of certain cards, so we're gonna fix that a little bit, and then we'll add that maybe for Monday. Happy Friday for you, Mr. Blockman. I'll be on baseball tonight.
Oh goodness, Yale's catching up. I need Auburn to win for my parlay. All right. All right, here we go. Good luck. Oh, where's my thing? You're going to hit Carolina Blue, Ted. You're going to hit. Zilla, Bass, James, Blockman, everybody's good. Here we go. All right, the dice. Nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Bass, James, James. Bass James James. Bass James James. Bass, you want disco? You want to go dancing? Disco fever? I'm thinking like a color blast or a color wheel. Or a manga, maybe. The manga has proven to been the e to be the easiest of the three to hit. I think we've hit two mangas and then one color wheel, one color blast. It's 2023 Panini Prism NASCAR Vroom Vroom Racing. Thank you, Maggio, for the push. Thank you, everybody else, for the filler. And to help us get to this point where we now get to enjoy the pack opening ceremony. We expect big things out of this. Expectations are high here in PYC 18. Expectations are riding high. When you're like Michael Jordan and you just win all the time, expectations are high. Well, that's a good pack. Good first pack. I see two low-numbered parallels in that first pack. I'm not going to say what they are, but let's just say they're good. They're good! Why? Why? We're the Michael Jordan. Bless is the Michael Jordan. We just hit. Expectations are high when all you do is win. 
Good luck, everybody. Let's have some fun. This is actually a really cool product because they don't make a lot of it. So things are really low numbered. And I like that. I like a product is like by default good when they don't make a lot of it. Thank you, Dave. Its chances of being good are just so much higher when they don't make a lot of it. I would say that very much pertains to this product. This product has a very strong vibe to it, a strong feel. There's good names. There's nice low numbered parallels. And they hit like just the right amount. Like they don't like overdo it, but they're also not like completely impossible needles and haystacks. Everybody keeps telling me that, Dave. I'm excited. Everybody tells me that Marvel Platinum is very sexy. I'm feeling it, Ryan. Feeling it. Could be a one of one, could be a, a super short print. Maybe both, why not both? Let's just find both. make the magic happen. No, no, you were you got 2 and 3, James. You got 2 and 3. So there was no picking required. Mr. Bass took the got the uh, disco spot and then you got the uh The other two. You make me feel I feel too. I won't dance the night away. Dancing, dancing, dance the night away. Oh, goodness gracious. Is that a good color? Let's dance the night away. Here we go. Good luck. Silver of Earnhardt Jr. Good first silver there. Silver of Tony Stewart. Hossiver on the orange reactive. Going to Karam on the Karam Karma. Now, this is a good color here. That looks like gold to me. It looks like it's going to be, wow, a gold auto of Zane Smith. Gold auto. The gold spot is Mr. NASCAR fan. Zane Smith to 10. 5 out of 10 on the numbering. Very nice card. Zane Smith Gold Auto to 10. Gold Autos are hard, man. That's a tough hit. And then Byron on the red. Hossiver Reactive Orange. It's a good hit. All right, we continue. Kozlowski on the throwback, Silver Randy Newman on the blue, and Joey Logano on the purple reactive, or purple velocity, excuse me, for Zilla. I like that card. Nice Logano on the purple VLO. Preci on the silver, and then Truex Jr. Kaleidoscope silver. I see a redemption coming up here. Redemption. It's a script prism auto of Daniel Suarez for Noah. Noah gets the Daniel Suarez scripts auto.
on the board. Dancing, dancing. Chase Briscoe on the green reactive and Jesse Wuji on the rookie piece. Blue and red hyper. Terry Labonte, orange reactive for Karen. I really like the orange reactive. It's like an underrated parallel. Austin Sindrick on the orange reactive. And we have a 75th Annie of Daryl Waldrip. Nice. That's a good one. Daryl Waldrip. Blaney on the silver. And Denny Hamlin on the blue and red hyper. Another 75th Annie card coming up here. With ink of Harry Gant. Behind it is a red Jeff Gordon, by the way, but Harry Gant with ink on the 75th Annie. These can be numbered to 75, by the way. What's so crazy is the first break I think we ever did of this product, I hit like, <laughs> I'm not even kidding. You guys could go back and, back and watch, reach, watch the recap. I want to say I hit like three or four numbered to 75, 75th. Any autos, and I thought it was like normal that, that they just all came autographed number to 75. And then in the next break, they were unnumbered, and I was very confused. And I haven't really seen like a numbered to 75 auto since then. Really, Rajay Karuth is the is the chasing this no way we hit a we hit his auto in the last in the last break I fit some really good Rajay Karuth I was gonna say yeah you have a blue scope of him I think I hit a I think I hit a gold of him. Pretty sure I hit a gold of him at one point. Maybe one gold? Was it a gold? I can't remember. Jeff Gordon on the red here as we get back to it. Ooh, we got cracked ice. The Carolina, Carolina blue ice for Laguna Beach behind the Gordon Silver. It's going to be Jesse Iwuji. Jesse Iwuji to 25 on the Carolina Blue Ice. We have multiple interesting cards in the back of this handful, though. Jordan Anderson on the silver. Looks like a lot of checkered flag for the dad tip here. Looks like multiple. There's one. There's one. Corey Heim to 50 with ink, sir. 7 out of 50 on the Corey Heim checkered flag auto. And you have another checkered flag in the back behind the King Richard Petty Orange Reactive. It's Dale Jarrett. Dale Jarrett also to 50. Clean copy. 29 of 50. Nice pack there. <laughs> nice pack on the checkered flags. That's the other Corey. Isn't that the actor you're talking about, Dave? over here. Oh. All right, there's a redemption in the back of this handful. Redemption. And some other interesting color here. Ah, championship trophy and a good one for Maggio. 
It's Jeff Gordon. I wonder if he might be the best one you can get. I'm not sure. Ben Rhodes on the blue, and then Randy Newman wearing his Oscar Myers finest on the purple velo for Zilla. Zilla, how do you feel knowing that you're about to be sent a card from Blaze? There's Herbert on the silver of a gentleman wearing a full Oscar Mayer getup. That's strong, bro. Oscar Mayer getup is strong. That's Jack Wood on an, a prism auto. Jack Wood. Jack Wood for Noah. Oscar Mayer winning. Hey man, they're good hot dogs. I'm more of a like a what do they call that? Sab Sabret or what's that? What's that? What's that? There's other hot dog companies I like. I don't know. Sabret is that what it's called? I don't know. Or co what's the kosher? The, there's a kosher one. Something something kosher kosher something. I like those. And not because they're kosher. I don't care if they're kosher. What does that one do? I've never heard of it. Parker Chase on the green. Sabret. Sabret. There you go. Sabret. Yeah, there you go. Parker Chase on the green reactive. Rusty Wallace. Blue and red hyper. Jeff Gordon, for the third time in this break, on the orange reactive now. It's a Jeff Gordon three, three boxer. Bobby Labonte on the 75th. Annie Dale Jarrett on the silver. And Sheldon Creed on the blue and red hyper. That looks like gold. Oh, and Carolina blue scope. We got some heat coming up here. Here's a gold. Auto. Auto. Jordan Anderson. Jordan Anderson on the gold autograph. Two gold autos in this three boxer for you, sir. Mr. Anderson. First in the print. First in the print on Jordan Anderson. I feel like whenever I watch a race, this guy comes in like fifth place, just for the record. Every time I watch, that dude comes in like fifth place. Raja Karuth on the red. The red for Iwasi. You want it, Maggio? Or should we be sending it to Iwasi? There's a blue Tyler Ankrum and a Carolina blue scope of Nick Sanchez, who looks like he's 15 years old. Nick Sanchez to 99 for Bacon Wrap. Silver of Justin Haley and then Amendinger. Come on. What makes him dirty? <laughs> what makes him dirty, Ted? Whoa. That's a rookie stripe auto. I've never hit one of these yet. Rookie stripe auto. It's a silver auto. Noah. This is what they look like. Those rookie stripe auto. Remember? We hit this before. Was it Raja before that we hit this up? I think it was Raja Karuth in the last break on the Rookie Stripe Silver Auto. This is exactly what this card was, the Rookie Stripe. See, now we know they can definitely get hit. Trust me, I've heard it, Ted. I'm saying it's a little inappropriate. I'm not saying I, I haven't heard it. <laughs> rookie Stripes, Sammy Smith, Silver Autograph for Noah. McMurray wearing his McDonald's finest. Josh Berry on the red and blue hyper. Silver of Zane Smith. Another silver of Truex. And then Blaney on the orange reactive. 75th Annie. 
of Bobby Labonte. That's a good one. Would you rather hit Terry or Bobby? Seventy fifth inning of Bobby Labonte. And then Chris Bell in the red. One box left. I would think Bobby, but I feel like some people might like Terry. It's okay, Ted. We love you. Hello, Mr. Anderson. We just hit we just hit a, an Anderson auto. Look. We hit your brother, Jeremy. We hit Jordan. Jordan Anderson. Gold auto. <laughs> I don't know if Nick Sanchez is any good. I feel like Ryan definitely would know since his nickname is NASCAR Fan 18. I guess he's he is very young. His his rookie he was a rookie last year. Was Nick Sanchez like one of the chases last year? I'm guessing he was, but I don't know if I'm right or not. How long have they had 22 NASCAR? How long have they had NASCAR racing on with Panini Prism? Well, that's unlucky. It's two green reactives already. All right, last box. Best of luck, guys. This brings us to the halfway mark of the case. Kurt Busch on the silver, Stenhouse Jr. on the National Pride silver. Another, ooh, silver auto here, Sammy Smith. We just, didn't we just hit him? We did. Two different Sammy Smith silver autos for you in this break, Noah. You get the rookie stripes, and you also get his regular. Yo no hablo espanol, Noah. My wife does, though. Ty Gibbs on the red. Jeff Gordon for the fourth time. Red and blue hyper now. We're just completing the Jeff Gordon rainbow in one break. A silver of Josh Williams. A silver of Kyle Busch. An orange reactive of Mr. Josh Berry. Oh, we got red, white, and blue of Alex Bowman. Alex Bowman to 35 with ink on the sensational red, white, and blue signature. Laguna Beach with the no look. Alley. 28 out of 35, sir. Red of Mr. Anderson. Championship trophy of Gordon. No way. Did you just 2X this? In a three-boxer? 
No way. Look at that, bro. Twice as nice, Maggio. I don't think I've ever hit one of them. Now we've got two. Sammy Smith Blue and Sheldon Creed on the purple below a base of Raja Karu. We press on. Wow, another red, white, and blue. Oh, you did it. You did it. Color wheel of Rusty Wallace for Maggio. You did it, sir. Let me take a picture of the Rusty. Let's go. Maggio's a hitter. He likes hitting things. You did it. Let's go, baby. Picture time. It's like hard to get. Hard to get a good picture of, but that's beautiful, man. The color wheels are nice. I'm not sure. I I have to I have to hit a few more color blasts or at least one more to decide if I think the color blast or the color wheel is more my thing. I think they're both really pretty. I'm not sure which I like better. I still don't know. This is really nice. The color wheel is also more, way more beautiful in person. This, you, even, even though you guys get to see all these pretty colors on the, on the, like there you go. That's a good angle right there. Now it looks pretty. Come on. That's what it looks like. Gorgeous, man. Silver of Mr. Anderson. And then Harvick as we get back to it on the victory lane, Silver. Red, white, and blue auto here. We ain't done. Of Jeff Burton. To 35. Red, white, and blue ink has been our friend in this case. My goodness. We've got five red, white, and blue autos in the first six boxes of this case that is tremendous laguna beach wow burton to 35 with ink is the fifth one wow grala on the blue mayor on the red and blue piper two handfuls left best of luck as we round the final turn the final bend if you will earnhardt jr silver Tony Stewart on the silver, and then Earnhardt Jr. again, but orange reactive for the Karam Karma, which was on full display last night when he hit a Caitlin Super Fractor. And what is that? Might just be an insert, but I don't know. I don't know. Probably just an insert. Ooh, ooh, piece of candy. Dale Jarrett on the Scripps Auto. Silver Auto for Noah of Dale Jarrett. That's a crazy story, Noah. Carl Edwards on the red. And then we have like a couple things. I don't know what that is. I think it's just a silver, but I don't want to. I don't know. We'll, we'll just get there when we get there, I suppose. It is. It's a, a Gillian. Todd Gillian on the throwback silver. And then a Harvick blue and a purple velo of Nemchek with the earbuds in there to close out the break. So far, this has been an outstanding case. This will take a moment for me to top load, so everybody grab a drink, take a pee. 
do what you need to do. I gotta top load the last like half of the break and then we'll. Did I say Jail Darrett? Did I say it backwards, Jail Darrett? No, I said Dale Jarrett, right? If I said it backwards, I'd, I mean, that's I'm, I'm totally capable. Bacon wrapped, you got one hit, but that was supposed to come out more. Carolina Blue will probably hit in the next six boxes. Red, white, and blue, I, if it keeps hitting, I, don't, I, I would be speechless. Purple Velo spot did work in both the first. Purple Velo spot and the red, white, and blue did work in the first six boxes. Impressive stuff, man. We haven't done it yet. We haven't done it yet, Will. We did. Uh, we did a, fir uh, a case already. But we we haven't done uh, this the new case. We just got it back in. All right, let's do a recap here. First case was good. We're not doing Dynasty today, Noah, no. All right, here's the recap for everybody to enjoy. Thank you, Chris. Nice hit from Raja there. All right, a couple Raja base, Raja on the red, the throwback silvers, a couple championship tropes of Gordon, some 75th Annies. There's Gant on the auto and Bobby Labonte as well. So 75th uh, Annie spotted okay. Those were blues. These are blue and red hypers. Oops, sorry, that's still a blue. And these are blue and red hypers. Mayer, Gordon, Wallace, Barry, Creed, Iwuji, and Hamlin. Some good blue and red hypers there. That spotted well. A couple green reactives, the purple Velos. There were four of them. There's Logano in the car. Nick Sanchez, our lone Carolina blue scope. Dale Jarrett and Corey Heim with ink on the checkered flag to 50. The red, white, and blue autos, Jeff, Jeff Burton and uh, Alex Bowman. So two in this three boxer and then uh, multiple on the previous one as well. Iwuji on the blue, Carolina blue scope, or Carolina cracked ice, excuse me, to 25. And then J Jordan Anderson, gold auto to 10. Zane Smith, gold auto to 10. Dale Jarrett, silver auto. Sammy Smith, silver auto. Rookie stripe, silver auto of Sammy Smith as well. Jack Wood on the redemption, and Daniel Suarez as well. But we also had one other very spicy piece in this break. 
and it was a color wheel of Rusty Wallace for Maggio. Beautiful. Beautiful. Congrats to Maggio. I'll beat the sword on that, of course. Thank you, everybody, for joining three boxes of 2023 Panini Prism NASCAR Racing. Pick your color number 18. That was the break. Thank you. Let's go, Maggio. That's what we're looking for, baby. I got to hit another color blast now to get even. One color blast, two color wheels, and two uh, mangas. I can do that, Ted. That's a deal. That's a deal. Ugh. Okay, let's put 19 up there, even though it won't go today, I don't think. I'll also upload the bid. Uploading the video. Let's take a look and update everything else and see how close we are if we're within striking distance. Yes, Moana is off to Mr. Anderson. So I think Disney is 10 away. WWE is there. And let's look at the UFC. Youth Quakes are off team just like we do the other stuff oh he's not on the Dodgers anymore it's a minor league Dodgers card where is he though he is now Chicago <coughs> and I would say since it's a minor league card I would say it has to go to current team if it said LA Dodgers or something anywhere on it then I would say them but it's like if it was a Reading Phillies card and they got traded from the Reading Phillies goes, farm yeah. system to the Orioles I would say Orioles where he's in the Cubs or the White Sox? Cubs. Cubs now. Cubs now, yeah. Yeah, it goes to the Cubs. Yeah, that's what I say, too. Yeah, it goes to the Cubs. He's not bad, by the way. This guy? Yeah, he's okay. You see Jackson Holiday and you sent him down? I did. You see, and you see him, you know. And then you know I got the Scroogey because I put him, I bet him for Rookie of the Year. Well, no, he'll get called up, but he won't have I know, I know. You know, you know. But I'd rather have Lane for now for AL Rookie Why? of the Year. Why? I know, he's still up there. Yeah, and you know what, you know, the real move? See, I, I got, there's another guy that's staying up in the majors. In the National League, okay, Jackson Churio. Yeah, that's for the all, Brewers. That's all he's staying up to. I I got him at a really good price. I got him at like plus eight fifty. Um, probably gonna have like four to one now. I don't know what he is now. I haven't looked in a while. I bet it's worse than eight fifty because I bet it a long time ago. But the reason it's worse is not necessarily because he's staying in the majors. It's because. Do you realize who the massive odds-on favorite was to win the National League Rookie of the Year was? Red's guy? No. It was Yamamoto. Oh, and he shipped And he got already. shelled in his yeah. first outing. Yeah. Shelled. If, you, if you're, 
like to be like a rookie of the year pitcher, you you can't have more than like two or three of those sort of outings in a whole season. You know, you can't get shelled. They brought you the stuff. Yeah, a couple things didn't make it, but they brought me most of it. Yeah, I, Minnie and I will go pick up the rest of it tomorrow together. Yeah, because I see you got this. Yeah, we Star got Wars. some good stuff. Which one's that? Star Wars 100 Jack Ross. Hell's yes. Star Wars. One, two, three, one, two, one, 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 and two. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Zebra's off. To the Brocco. As well as the Groovy, baby. Groovy jackpot spot is off. That's a good spot. We just hit jackpots, but no groovies. No groovies at all, I don't think, in this case yet, actually. Now, I don't think any groovies. Zero groovies. Zero groovies so far. But I don't think that break is going to be close enough to go today. And I got to switch to the baseball channel in like 25 minutes anyway. So I may just do a little switcheroo early, give myself like a 15-minute breather to order some food or something. Let me take a look here. Everything is pretty close, but we're like primed for greatness on Monday. And we'll keep adding new stuff into the store. Disney's down to 10. Leaf Metal Pop Century is down to 18. Sapphire Formula One, a couple spots are off there. The Star Wars Kakawau is flying. The Star Wars Kakawau is flying. No, don't say that, Bullwinkle. I need Auburn to win. I'm on baseball tonight, and then I'm on pop on Monday. I don't know. I, I don't know when I'll be doing baseball next. Maybe after tonight. Maybe like Tuesday. I really liked Auburn today. I'm surprised. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I didn't change the thing back. I'm really surprised that Yale is holding on to this game, Winkle. No, it's Yeah. I fired live on Yale. No. No, I did for a ton. A minute into the game. Plus what? Plus 13 and a half. Oh, you have a great line. You're going to cover. Um, uh, in, the, in the beginning of the game, I mean, this guy got wood, hurt. I know. And he went out of the game. No, he didn't get But we, then he came back. The Yale guy. But then, no. Yeah, but then the Auburn guy got ejected. The Auburn guy. The Auburn guy got hurt. And then the other Auburn guy got ejected three yeah. minutes into the game. Yeah. So they went from 10 people on the bench to, to eight. Yeah. Now, the one guy, I think, got taped up and came back. Yeah. But the one guy got ejected. Well, he got ejected. He's solid, too, by the way. Yeah. And he's a big game player. He plays good in big games, that guy that so, got yeah, ejected. So that's why I was like 13 and a half. I fired. Yeah, that was a really good bet. They're down by four right now with three and a half left. Really good bet. I mean, they're always, they play really smart. Let me take a look, best friend, and show you what we what it is, Okay. I don't really remember it. The, the problem is I don't remember everything in the first case, best friend. I would have to look at the recap myself. But I'll take a look. Let me see. I remember we hit some really cool freaking cards. And now we got two more. It flew. Like, everybody loved it. Okay, here it is. I found it. Best friend, you want me to link you the videos? I found them. I found them. I'm gonna link you the two videos. I don't. It's don't be sorry, Will. We're here for you, bro. That's it's it's part of it's. That's what I'm here for. Here are the two videos. I'm trying to like look at them myself. Just I'm just gonna go to the recaps.
The cards are really nice. They're very high quality. Yo, what's up, Hama? Was that a real hi? Was that a real video, by the way? That one I sent you the other day was that actual? Was that real? That, no, 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 that, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's a joke. It's a joke, right? Kachi kachi. <laughs> I no, was that's like, like, that's like, that's like old school, like early mid eighties, like comedy that they do. Okay, I like it though. I thought it was, I should, I th I'll send you one. I'll send you. Send one. me like the greatest hits of like all the kachi oh, from the eighties. Oh, I'll send. You ever heard of Rap Ribblinger? No. I will. Perfect. You'll understand why I talk the way I talk and why I say what I say. <laughs> I liked it. I thought it was. I, I, ha I was like, it has to be a joke. <laughs> oh my god, they're down by two. This is torture. I like the die cuts. I like the silvers are a good spot. The final frames is a good spot. The final frames is a good spot. I feel like it's an underrated spot. The May the Forest Be With You cards are very cool. The poster art is my favorite, but it's not that easy to hit. The nebulas are pretty awesome. The fireworks are hard to hit, but they're really cool. You should have taken them live money line, kid. They're tied with two and a half left. Wow. Fourteen and a half point dogs live? That would have paid a pretty penny. Yeah, for sure. Mm. The poster art is my favorite, but it's hard to hit. The script art is also really hard to hit, but it's really pretty, man. The fireworks, usually you get a couple. The posters are by far my favorite, Will. I love, that's just, I mean, my personal preference. It's all about what you like, but. Ryan, just letting you know, you bought it in 20. There's 19 in the store also. 19 is the one that's next. I think you bought a couple of the spots in 20. You may have meant to buy in 19.
the nebula is still there. The gold is really tough to hit, but that must be super rewarding if we hit it. The final frames are good, man. And the base spot just gets a ton. The anniversary, these are all good. So everything is good. We may not, we may not be able to get, unless, unless best friend wants to take some spots, we may not be able to get the Star Wars to go today. But I'm looking forward, I'm looking forward uh, to just doing everything on Monday, a bunch of stuff. I understand. That's kind of the idea about it. It's like the nebula spot. <laughs> um, Marvel. Minnie told me she would add it today. I'll remind her. Hopefully she has time to take care of it later. But I'll be on baseball, so when it gets added, I'll be able to tell you guys at least. Minnie said she would add it today. So we'll be able to do it on Monday. The Marvel Platinum. We're going to do it by the color. I know she's working on it. Wow, Auburn's down by one right now. I just need the money line, Bullwinkle. Can you message me first, best friend, just so I could just... Just message me best friend or will be. Just to make sure I have it. That's my Instagram. Just message me on Instagram. Just say best friend. And then I'll message you when we add it. Let me see. Yeah, take. Yes, I got you. I'm going to put it up right now. Hold on. Of course. I got to take it out for you. Hold on. Oh my god, shot clock violation? Are you serious right now? Oh my god. Nintendo, if they ever made a Nintendo collectible product, card collectible, I I would want to rip every single every single break of it. I wouldn't let anybody else touch it. That's the then it'd be the first time that I actually like where it was personal. <laughs> I would love to see those. Send me pictures of that stuff. Best friend, you're good. Thank you, sir. I know we're right there on the Star Wars, but I'm going to wait until Monday to rip it. It's okay. I want... We don't have that much of it anyway. What I will do, though... What I will do... I think we have two cases of it. Wow, 
Wow, double D. Let's F and go. Nice, bro. That's massive. Massive congrats. I'm putting another Kakawao in the store now for you guys. Slightly adjusted prices. I'm not raising the stuff that hasn't been bought in number five <coughs> or number four. I'm only lowering stuff. Thank you, C-Dub. Well, we're going to do them on Monday. Oh, my God. Yale's going to win. I'm going to close everything down now and get ready for baseball, but... But we're primed and prepared and ready for Monday. We're going to do Lorcana. We're going to do Leaf Metal Pop Century. Marvel Platinum's going to get added to the store later today. WWE is close. We'll do more of that. Kakawao's right there. Lorcana's right there. 
I'm gonna shut it down, but I'm gonna see you guys on the baseball channel in like 10 minutes. Nah, I'm not sure, Bess. Probably not. It'll probably be, I don't know, do you like it during the day? Yeah, I would love that dad tip. Baby Yoda. Wow. I think I lost the under. I lost the under. Oh, God. It's lost it badly. It's okay. I'm like winning every other under. Have you ever seen a game 100 to 100 regulation? I don't think I ever have. In college? Yeah. Never. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure they have a stat on it. All right, I'll see you guys on baseball in like 10 minutes. Love you.